Join us for our early bird special. Every day at 8 a.m. we will offer you an incredible saving on a fantastic product. This offer is for one day only and while stocks last. So join us early to not miss out on some incredible savings. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are you? Hope you had a lovely, lovely Christmas. It's great to be back with you. For the last time, this is it, my last show. So thank you very, very much for joining me. We're gonna have a brilliant five hours. We wanna make sure it's as interactive as possible. I watched Tasha's show yesterday and it was so much fun. So we definitely wanna um, get you all involved today. Starting as we always do, with a brilliant, brilliant deal as our early bird. Now, it doesn't look that much, but you don't know what it is. It's a mystery bundle, but Let's have a look and see what's inside this one because they're all going to be slightly different. I can tell you it will be a mystery zip bundle, but I mean, you could get all different colours, different size or varying in size, which is such a great saving. Bag makers and dressmakers, this is a brilliant saving for you. A saving, hang on, it's worth £30. Today you're getting it for £5. Today you're getting it for £5. And in this selection, I mean, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten zips in there. Normally uh, would be £30, worth £30 today for just five. The graphics will be coming live very soon. As soon as those graphics come live, it will go quickly, just to warn you. As always, technical gremlins are here, aren't they, of course? Um, but you will get a selection of colours, you get different sizes. I mean, these sort of zips are great for bag makers, aren't they? These are your really big, durable, durable zips. You might even get smaller zips for your, uh, for your dressmaking or little purses. This is your 10-inch zip. Mystery zip bundle. You know it's going to be £5, so everybody get on the phone line nice and early. Randomly selected, oh, you can see there, you've got different colours. You've got a um, yellow zip and a blue zip in that one. Mystery bundle, worth 30 pounds, worth 30 pounds. I've got 10 zips in this bundle. I'm not sure, how many were on that picture? There's a 10 in that bundle there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh yeah, so I think you will get a 10. It's just going to be all different sizes. It's a pack of 10 zips. Oh yeah, it does say on the graphic there. You'll definitely get 10 zips. Just a mixture of colours and a mixture of sizes and different types. So for bag makers or dressmakers, this is perfect. How are we getting on with our graphics, Hannah? I think that we think we've had to reset them, but they're going to be coming in very soon. If I were you, I would be there early, ready to secure these. Be quick, be quick, be quick. <laughs> Two big red zips in this one. All of you white zips, your navy blue zips. I will want to hear from you today on how your Christmas was. What did you get up to for Christmas? Um, oh, okay, so Hannah's appeared. There you go. I think they're appearing on screen now. There you go. Ah, so they technically worked before but they weren't coming up on screen. So I think some of you managed to check out a minute ago. You're getting 10 zips. Anyway, the graphics are live. Make the most of it whilst you can for just five pounds. That is a lot of zips for five pounds. Well done to all of you that managed to um, check out on those without the graphics on screen. There's now less than 100 of the mystery bundles, which sounds a lot. It's not. We started with hundreds and hundreds of mystery bundle zips. Just five pounds. Oh, you can't go wrong, can you? Honestly, today, all day long, we've got 60% off. This is even more than 60% off. That's worth 30 pounds. I can't even work that out. 30 pounds, down to a five pounds. I can't work out what the set percentage is, but it is way over 60%, isn't it? That's amazing. 83% to be exact, if my maths are correct because I've worked that all out, uh, that out all on my own, in my head. <laughs> Not with the help of producer Hannah in my ear and her calculator. Oh, do you know what? We've got a lovely team today. We've got Hannah here. We've got Paul back. He's back. He's been ever so poorly, you know, really, really poorly. But um, it's all right today. It's all right today. <laughs> Tom's here as well. We've also got Lucy, our floor manager. So sending all the messages for us all. Um, Tom, how many more days are you? When are you here? 
today and tomorrow. I think quite a few people are here today and tomorrow. Paul's today and tomorrow. Oh, I also um, want to show you how you can keep in contact with all of us as well today. Uh, just five pounds. I forgot to tell you about my um, plasma, didn't I? Well, I haven't made one, no. I was going to ask you to make me one, Paul. <laughs> I don't know how to do it. What I'll have to do is I'll write it on a piece of paper. I'll write it on a piece of paper. Then I can show you. Or Hannah can. Okay, she can do it in the break. We can do it later on. I'll come assist Hannah. Okay. Ten zips for five pounds. We're going to take the graphics out because there's only about 20 of those remaining. That is brilliant value for money, isn't it? A whole mystery zip bundle for just five pounds. Oh, today's exciting. We've got a whole... Well, a whole mixture. Have a look at today's menu. Let's see what we can look forward to. Way <laughs> Today, 8 o'clock, warehouse clearance. What's at 9, you ask? Warehouse clearance. At 10, surprise, surprise, we've got warehouse clearance. 11 o'clock, a whole hour of our warehouse clearance. And to finish off the show, another hour, the last ever hour with me, of our warehouse clearance. It's going to be brilliant. We have got such a great selection, a mix, mixture of all sorts today for everybody, something for everybody. If you want to get in touch with us, please, please do. I would love to have your messages today, all your messages via our web chat on the website. It would be lovely to hear from you. You have made me feel so, so welcome here over the last two years. It's been absolute privilege and thank you all so much for teaching me so much as well so click um watch at the top if you scroll down past the watch live screen you'll see the little box um which you'll need to log in uh, to see or create an account which is free to do so and that means that you can send in nice short and sweet messages to us here in the studio and hannah can send them through to me um also underneath will be everything listed that's from today's show whilst it's available so at the moment there's now less than 15 of those if you want one of those mystery bundles that are £5 only, then absolutely snap that up. If you want to send in a photograph, if you want to send in a longer message, then you can do it via our email, which is studio at sewingquarter.com. If you want to send in any of your favourite makes from Sewing Quarter, any of your favourite products from Sewing Quarter, if you just want to say hello, tell me about your Christmas, we want to make today as interactive as possible. Oh, do you know what? I'm going to have a little chair today. I felt left out. I saw Tash having a little seat, John having his lunch, and I thought, do you know what? I, I'm going to have a um, nice little chat with everybody today. Right. It makes you feel um, a bit more informal when we're sitting, doesn't it? So, let's have a look. We're going to um, have a look at two beautiful bolts. How much is on here? There looks loads and loads and loads. You've got our lovely lilac spot on bolt to start our amazing show. There's only one, it's a 10 meter bolt. Fastest fingers first on this one. 32 pounds, 39 pounds and 92 pence. This is normally 99 pounds and 80 pence. 10 meters of your lilac, lilac spot on. Well, I say that, did you know, Hannah, that for the last three years, I think we've been saying this wrong, we always call this spot on, don't we? It's called spot on lilac. <laughs> How funny, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. Well done, the first person that put that in the basket is the person that got it. Well done, you're very speedy. Okay. <laughs> don't worry, I don't know what the posting note says. Oh, it just says it's, it's coming on sewing quarter Saturday at 8 a.m. That's all it says. No secret messages. <laughs> Only one of these as well. £39.92. That's 60% off. It's gone. It's gone, gone, gone. Merry Christmas, everybody. Hope you had a lovely, lovely Christmas. Um, I still feel full. Does anybody else? I, I've probably made a new record of how much I've eaten in the last few days. Oh, and I, I still are like, continuing to say, right, I've got to eat all this chocolate to get it out of my house before January, because then January, that's it. No more chocolate in the house. Um, let's do our lovely Sue Quinn's bear. Oh, it's not Sue Quinn. It's, um, oh, what's the lady's name? Amazing Crafts. I'm trying to remember her name. She came in, didn't she? Mm, this is the buttercup teddy bear. Remind me, text me, text me in, text me um, the lady's name. Can you remember? 
No, it wasn't. Mohair teddy bear, everything that you need is it going to be in here. So there's your joint, you've also got your thread, um, you've got your toy stuffing. It's lovely, and of course, all of your instructions. What a great gift for somebody in this massive organza bag. Now, this mohair alone, just the mohair that you're getting here, would be brilliant at £17.20. Those of you that make heritage bears and these beautiful, beautiful bears will know that the price on the mohair for £17.20 alone is brilliant. Uh, now, we've got really limited stock on this. More of you have got it in your basket than we have availability at the moment. It's still fine to check out. It's not yours until you check out. Amazing discount and just remember 1 p.m.p. all day today. So if you've bought one of those already, well done. Oops, there we go. Fiona's pattern, Fiona Hesford. So I want to know for my last show some of your favourite moments from Sewing Quarter. So your favourite guests, maybe your favourite demos. I'll absolutely always remember when I very first met Fiona Hesford. Hannah and I were reading about her uh, before she came in. Uh, Wendy had done us a bit of a brief of telling us about her and we did a bit more research. And before we even met Fiona, we loved her, didn't we? We were so envious of her life, in fact. She had this fabulous, she lived in Paris. She met this artist man, married him. She used to, um, she had a cat called Madame Maybelline. And she's um, got a, uh, like a beach hut on the seaside where she does all of her makes. Oh, it just sounds amazing. And she rides her bicycle down, oh, with her matching clothes. This is the Fiona Hesford So Girl duster coat. Good morning, Sharon in Derbyshire. Good morning, Bix. Uh, Bix? Bix? <laughs> so sad to see the end of the show. I know. It is end of an era, isn't it? We've um, loved all of the designs and designers and bargains. Wish you the best of luck for the future. Thank you, Sharon. Thank you very, very much for your message. Lovely to hear from you. Remember, Sewing Quarter will still be on, um, uh, it will still be a website, so you can still buy from Sewing Quarter. But we are, it is our last few days on air with you. So do make the most of these prices. Hello, Lorraine. Lorraine's messaging. I must say as well, Annette, thank you so much for my hat. I opened it this morning and it's amazing. Hannah, um, I'm, I've been very envious of Hannah's hat, so I'm really, really um, chuffed with that. Thank you. Lorraine, hello. Hi, Vicky. Wishing you all the best in the new year. You've been great. Thank you very, very much. I've loved being here. Tina in Aberdeenshire. Morning, Vic. <laughs> so sad this is your last show. Watching you turn into a confident and entertaining presenter has been a pleasure. Oh, thank you. Happy New Year. What's that face for, Tom? Tom's like, oh, no, well, you haven't really, have you? <laughs> he says, you've always been confident and entertaining. <laughs> Alison in Cheshire, good morning Vixen crew, um, just wishing you a belated Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I will miss you all from Ali, Ali will miss you too, will miss you too. Has everybody signed up to John Scott Sewing World? I think everyone has, he's got about 20,000 um, people who have subscribed, we look forward to, to following John. Two pounds for your lovely sew gold duster coat, these are great as well aren't they? I mean you're going to be able to use with so many different fabrics. All of your uh, sizes and fabric requirements will be the second image on the web. Christine, thank you for your message. There's now how many single figures? Once this is gone, it's gone. It's normally $17.99. That looks, again, a lot more than 60% off. <laughs> that is crazy low, just two pounds. Hello, Christine. I haven't got Christine's message on here. I think it's all just catching up. Christine's message hasn't come through to the um, iPad. Oh dear, it's all right. Uh, right, let's do the Celia and Rosalind. We'll start with Rosalind. Jules's patterns, Jewel Fallon's patterns. The price is ridiculous. This is always one of the most popular brands that we offer you. Dressmakers, I would be stocking up on your dressmaking patterns today. This is not 60% off, is it? I mean, that is absolutely crazy. 18 pounds this normally is, today it's two pounds. Hello, Christine, morning all. Great to see you smiling and happy as ever. It's not good watching the final shows. Good luck to everybody. Thanks for everything. Oh, I know. Do you know what? I don't like goodbyes. I'm not very good at goodbyes. So I'm just going to make sure we have a lovely, lovely last five hours. Stop it, Paul. Paul's been taking pictures from every place. Should we have a picture? Buy our cup of tea. It's the last time we're going to make a cup of tea together. Should we have a picture in the studio? It's the last day. <gasps> oh. I know. And we're friends, Paul. I see you loads. We'll see each other all the time. It's like, no, I'm not going to see you anymore. 
Unfortunately, I'll, it won't be the last time I'll be seeing you, Paula, unfortunately. OK, Celia. Oh, yeah, Han. Yeah, it'll probably be nice to see Hannah. No, I'm only joking. I'll see Hannah as well. We'll all see each other. This is the thing, is we'll all, we're all such a lovely family here. Speaking of a lovely family, um, I met, I've been, uh, well, the last few gigs I've done in Litchfield, a lovely lady called Jude has come to see me. Judith, I think she put a picture on the Facebook fan page. And um, there was a lot of us all there. There was me, obviously, Laura, because uh, Andy, her boyfriend, is the one who I play in Two Tone Acoustic with. Um, no, they've not got engaged yet. I was waiting over Christmas. I was waiting, I was waiting. No, they're not engaged yet. Laura and Andy. Uh, we'll make it happen and you'll know about it. And there was also Jeremy Joe was there, Munch was there, and Judith came over and she said, is that Jeremy Joe and Munch? I've heard all about them. So yeah, we're always all around. You'll, um, I'm sure we'll all bump into each other again. 18 pounds down to two pounds for your Sew Me Something pattern. All your instructions, your lovely pattern paper as well. That one's sold out. Everything so far, I believe, sold out. We've got the, uh, the French boys. I was talking to, um, was it to, I say this, the French boys, this is the French boys pattern, but this could be a girls or boys unisex pattern. In fact, I think Baffa's got this one. Becky's got this and she's doing her own artwork on the back of the hoodie. If you haven't joined her Facebook fan page yet, absolutely do because uh, she's great on social media. I must say, I'm, I'm not very good. I'm really, I need to get with the times and post more on Facebook and Instagram. Do you, Hannah? Yours, you've got a new um, post, a new Instagram page, haven't you? Hmm? Pa Patterns and Place is a new Instagram for Hannah. Just two pounds, and of course you can follow Paul. Just so she can put all of her holidays, she's off to Burma. She's off to Burma, we can follow her on her holidays. 17.99 down to just two pounds. I love this little um, pocket that it comes in as well. Great hoodie and sweater pattern, it's gone. Oh, a holiday's gonna be unbelievable. <laughs> Doesn't really work, does it? Can you tell Paul's in my ear today? Uh, right. The Motifs and Borders cross-stitch book. No, that's absolutely fine. We've done all of the patterns now. They're all the dressmaking patterns sold out. All sold out. Inspired, um, Oh, lovely. We had the actually we had the lady in for this. It's lovely. You've got 200 beautiful floral designs in here. You've got alphabets. Oh, look, it's signed as well. It is a signed. Yes, I have seen Tom Hanks. I didn't get to meet him with my party trick. Guys, I did try to do the banana trick, and I also tried, you know, this one. No, but you might see me on telly. If you watch New Year's Eve, the Graham Norton show, you may see me going like this in the audience trying to get on telly. But um, no, I didn't get picked out. And um, I was in the queue thinking, why haven't I been picked for my party trick? I put lists of party tricks that, if I'm being honest, I'm honest, I, I, I don't know how to do half of them, but I thought I'll learn on the day. If I get picked, I'll just have a go. <laughs> I told them I could fit 50 Maltesers in my mouth, and I thought, <laughs> that could go really wrong. Kieran was like, why are you doing all these silly things on telly? But anyway, they didn't pick me, no. But they didn't pick anybody. Nobody was on. So I was quite relieved that I, I was taking it quite personally. No, Tom Hanks didn't talk about his, um, his, his love of typewriters. He didn't talk about Aston Villa Football Club. Um, do you know who I loved though? Stephen Graham. I didn't know who Stephen Graham was and he was so, so lovely. He was so humble. He was really nice. Um, he's a Liverpoolian um, actor. He was in Line of Duty and This Is England, a few others, yeah. Look at these. I love the gelato one. £14.95. There's loads of lovely feminine girly prints in here, aren't there? borders, cross-stitch prints and um, images. Even if you select just a couple of these, the value for money is amazing. Was well, 14 95 it's now just five pounds. Hi, Margaret. Hi, Margaret. It's lovely, isn't it? Just five pounds, 14 95 
your modern motifs and borders. How many of these have we got left? Nearly gone, nearly gone. There's still a couple of those if you want it. There's Paul's Instagram if you want to follow him. He's got a slide for himself. Oh, I, oh this is why I asked you, would you make me a PowerPoint slide, please? Oh, look at him in his double breast jacket. It's a lovely jacket, that is. Follow Paul, the underscore Duke 1111. Yeah, absolutely. Another one of my highlights of, um, I I've worked with Sterling Silver for years and years, and when um, Ian actually bought in some of these RED Normans, honestly, they are absolutely amazing. I love how it comes in a box within a box. <laughs> and such beautiful thimbles. Look at the detail on it. £20. It was just, it was £49.99, which is a great price anyway, and it's now just £20. Lovely detail, Victorian style thimble in sterling silver. And they're all hallmarked as well. They are all hallmarked. I just love all the detail. I think that is such a lovely gift for somebody, especially as it comes so beautifully presented in that lovely box. Remember, Harry D. Norman, associated with royalty, associated with liberties, associated with some really, really big brands. John Lewis, I know that they've, um, they've made for as well. Have a look into uh, in, more into the company, have a bit of a research, but that is a brilliant price. Whether you're using it, I mean, of course, it is a thimble, so you can use it for your hand stitching, but also if it is just more of an ornamental thimble. My grandma, um, yeah, my grandma collects thimbles. I used to always play as a child, hide the thimble. <laughs> the childhood thrills I had. <laughs> my grandma will always remember me playing hide the thimble. Here's a lovely photograph from Sharon. Hello, Molly and Daisy. Good morning. As I said earlier in my message, I'll be sad to see the show go. I love all of the presenters. I'm very proud to say my granddaughters are new sewers. They've all loved getting ideas from the show. The two girlies made box bags from the fabric when I first joined and carried on since. Bye bye from Molly, who's on the left there. She's age 13. And Daisy, who's eight. Oh, thank you very, very much, Sharon, for your message. And thank you so much to Molly and Daisy. This is what I was going to say. And they're lined as well. Oh, look at those bags. That's amazing, isn't it? Please keep sewing. Molly, Daisy, please keep sewing. We might be seeing some new Great British Sewing Bee winners in the making. This is what I've, personally, this is what I've loved about Sewing Quarter, is that somebody who's completely new to sewing and you've really, really embraced me and taught me so much. I never in a million years thought that I would be able to do quilting and patchwork and dressmaking, bag making and they're skills that I'll have for life now so thank you very much. Not only uh, as it inspired newbies to get involved but also people who might not have sewn for years and years to pick up a needle and thread again and get sewing or get on the sewing machine, dust off the, the dust off their sewing machine and have a go or maybe dressmakers try quilting or quilting try dressmaking. So it, it has been such an amazing community and I think that's what we wanted to, um, I know Natasha said the, the premise of the show before we even started was to create a sewing family and we absolutely have, which that won't go, that won't go. Shall we do a fat quarter vintage book? These fat quarter books are amazing. You've got 25 quick and easy projects to make all from fat quarters or all from um, you know, smaller pieces. Five pounds, that makes your price per project crazy. Susie John's actually even signed this. The basics, it's all really, really, really um, clear as well. There's more of you that have, um, have put this in your basket than there are available. In fact, it's gone, gone. Should we do some fabric? What do you mean I'm a rebel? It's because, look, I've got my cup of tea. I've got my cup of tea. <laughs> Would you laugh if I said, oh, look, I'm being a rebel, I've got my beer here, or my, my gin and tonic. No, just a cup of tea. My herringbone, beautiful linen. It's 100%, 100% linen for four pounds a half metre. Oh, I love, love, love a Billy Bargain. Was 9.99, it's now four pounds a half metre. Paul, you need to rest today. 
Paul's been ever so poorly. Everything we've shown by the early bird is sold out. Everything we've shown by the early bird is gone. If you want to make the most of that zip bundle, we had a really big quantity of those, make the most of it. 9.95 a metre, down to just four pounds. God. Let's make it so everything sells out today. Let's make sure. <laughs> oh, I love this corded lace. Oh, see, this it's I don't want to get all sad. I don't want to get all sad because it but this reminds me of my um wedding show. I did my wedding show with Ellen. I don't know if you know, but um yeah, I was I did get married earlier this year. <laughs> I don't think I mentioned it every show I did, didn't I? Um, but no, Ellen Saunders made beautiful uh, Mother of the Bride style dress and top with this. Ah, oh, your pink corded lace. We've got so many lovely memories, haven't we? From £7.99 to £3.20. Paul and I have agreed that this has been our favourite place to work ever. Hi, Grace. Grace. The free number along the bottom of the screen, if you call that with the order number, um, then you'll be able to, they'll be able to help you out. There is a small delay with delivery due to, obviously, the sales and obviously due to bank holidays and Christmas. But I can absolutely promise you everything is on its way. Everybody will get their orders. But please do um, speak to the team if you want to. $7.99. We're clearing the warehouse, you see, so of course it'll all be sent to you. I love the... Um, the edge of this as well, look at that. It's beautiful, there's only a metre left. There's one metre left. Whether you want to take some inspiration from some of Alistair's designs and cover things like hot water bottles, you don't need to, you don't need to be worried about working with lace. Have a go for £3.20, a half metre. Brilliant value. Or 7 99 down to just £3.20. That's a beautiful colour as well, isn't it? It's that rose pink. That would make a, a beautiful dress. Half a metre, half a metre left. Okay. Do you know what this is? This would make, I think some really nice wide leg trousers would look nice with these. <laughs> what about 60? Oh, dressmakers, if you're starting out um, dressmaking, have a go. Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. I know we're, um, we're not that far away from next year though, are we now? The countdown started. <laughs> What about for, yeah, red trousers or white blouse would look so striking, wouldn't it? Some really nice wide leg trousers or a blouse. Lovely, it's very red. 100% polyester Georgette fabric. It's gorgeous scarlet. Even if you're not sure what you're making with it yet, I'd stock up. Stash it. Stash it, stash it. Somebody's taken the lot. Well done. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Do you know what I was about to say? So I, um, I was in an ABBA tribute band show and I think all of our costumes have been made of this. All of our cat suits, especially Bjorn's. He had um, <laughs> quite a <laughs> four-way stretch. Yeah, he needed an extra stretch. Um, the ivory lycra all the way stretch. Honestly, it's not the most flattering costumes in our ABBA show. The lighting has to be just right. <laughs> now, this is great for dance costumes. Leggings. Look, it's, uh, it is your always stretch. Ivory Lycra for £1.80. Vicky, if you're watching, she's our ABBA leader. She makes a lot of the ABBA costumes. You need to stock up on this. ABBA leader, yeah. I'm not changing my statement. She is our ABBA leader. <laughs> oh, on Christmas Eve, they did ABBA's greatest, um, like 20 of the greatest ABBA songs. They're all such good songs, aren't they? Let's face it. I can't believe you've never come to see me in my ABBA show, Paul. One pound 80, a half metre. And can I show you how wide it is? Extra wide as well. 
I think if anybody that makes, you know, their grandchildren's dance costumes or children's or your own dance costumes, leotards and all sorts, this is great for that. Let me see. Do you know what? No, it's not see-through, is it? I've got like a black top underneath, but that's a very dark top. If you wear nude, nude underwear, you wouldn't see through it. <laughs> Hannah's worried about wearing this as, uh, to her first um, yoga session, <laughs> thinking it might be slightly see-through, but look, no. And that's good. <laughs> £1.80. The moment there's availability on your Lycra. I think that might be the only Lycra of the show. <gasps> Need to stock up on our Lycra. Okay, Jersey, get your overlocker out. This is brilliant for summer. Your yellow and green speckled stripe. Avalana jersey, I absolutely love this. We've seen beautiful designs of this, haven't we? With 7 99 it's £3.20. Thank you for all of your messages. Keep them coming in. We want to make today's show as interactive as possible. What have been your favourite moments of sewing quarter? Your favourite, um, all of your favourite products? Any tips? If you've got any questions, let us know. Just £3.20. During the break, Hannah's going to help me put together um, a slide so I can show you how you can keep in touch with me. I thought you just said that you were going to have a go at sorting it, Paul. Oh, have you? Thank you. Um, I could just type it. Yeah. Coral was £6.49, down to just £2.60 a half metre. Coral's lovely, isn't it? That's like your pinky coral. Was six pound forty down to two pound sixty a half meter? I found a new Christmas song on Christmas Day, and I think it's my new favourite. It's called Wrapped in Paper. <laughs> yes, have you heard it? I'm gonna wrap myself in paper. It's really good. It's like a, a Eurovision track that never went to Eurovision. That's all. I, that's all I'm gonna sing. Probably is actually, it probably is rude to me. I probably could sing it all to you. Not get into trouble. Oh, it's velvet. This is plush, plush. I think we've made beautiful elephants with this before. New babies. Oh, my sister-in-law. My sister-in-law is having a baby boy in April. She's due. Oh, I need to get some of this to make her some bits and bobs. Don't I stock up whilst we can. 9.99 down to four pounds a half metre. Is that all right? Oh, it's so, so silky, silky soft. Absolute plush baby blue velvet. Who's going to do this upholstery course with me in January? Hannah, when you're back off your travels, are you going to come and do this upholstery course with me? Intensive driving course to do. Hannah, Hannah, but you don't need an intensive driving course. You can drive, can't you? But really scared, okay. Hannah's had some, um, had some I was going to say funny driving instructors, but she hasn't had funny driving instructors. That's not, that's not the right way of putting it. But she just has a chat with them on the, the, the driving lessons. She's just been chatting with them, so she doesn't... She knows all about their personal lives. <laughs> she gets really into being their counsellor, but actually she hasn't learned to drive. So Hannah's been learning to drive for how many years? As long as I've known you when you're 18, you're now 28. <laughs> She's going on her intensive course. She will pass in February. Oh, look at this beautiful baby pink. Had could drive. She's got 10 years experience. <laughs> baby pink, beautiful velvet. Half a metre is four pounds. The baby blue, I believe, is about to sell out. 
This would be nice for my reupholstery course, though, I was thinking. You know, like if you were to buy an old-fashioned um, dressing room stool and you could just reupholster it with this and it would look so, so pretty and so plush. I'm imagining this with the nice silver studs going around. It's gone. I've got green velvet. Who have you met? Is this a, a man? <gasps> oh, wow, look at this. Oh, I love bottle green. This is Laura's colour. This is Laura. I think if you've got... Um, look at this. I'd like a dress with this colour. If you've got auburn hair, this is the best colour. She wears, does she wear a dress this colour in Titanic, Rose? Oh, it's just beautiful. This colour is stunning. Oh, when she goes down to the Irish bar, down to the bottom deck. That's Hannah's favourite scene. I was talking about, um, <laughs> I was talking about, that, you know, this, if you go to the cinema, I think they should start doing some of your old films, your old favourite films, of what you would want to see, like you could rent out the cinema and play whatever you want. Does that ever happen anywhere? I'd love that. They do, though. You can watch whatever films. Because I'd love to watch Titanic at the cinema. Oh, look at this. This launched for our birthday last year. The Secret Cinema in London, no? No! Apparently, you dress up for the films. They do a full event. Hannah went to the Moulin Rouge. So do you dress up? Do you dress up? They said you a role that you're supposed to dress up for. Oh my word! Right, I'm going to have to have a look through this. What's it called? The Secret Cinema. They're doing a dirty dancing one. <gasps> yes, that's my sort of thing, isn't it? I've been to outdoor cinemas. I like the outdoor cinema. I've never seen the one where they give you rolls. Nine ninety nine to just four pounds. I would love to go to Greece, dress up as Greece. Laura for the Christmas party. She's like, uh, I'm not gonna, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna dress up really. And then she was like, I'm just gonna wear my um, leather trousers and my, and she basically described Sandy, you know, the end of Greece. Not dressed up at all, oh, Laura. Dun, dun, dun. You can just imagine her, can't you? Right. The beautiful blue. Oh, and this is our sewing quarter blue, isn't it? It's that love... Well, it's just blue now, isn't it? Our turquoise blue. <laughs> Does that look like the colour of, um, you know, the film that maybe you've got to make a cloak out of this for a certain little girl? Come on, we've got to let it go now. Did anyone... Did anyone... Um, did anybody uh, build a snowman? <laughs> oh, sorry, we're having too much of, of a laugh here, don't we? <laughs> no, don't laugh, it will hurt your chest, Paul. He's all right, he's all right. Okay, so, in here is your quilting ruler system. Now, we've only got medium. It's... Um, Celestian, Celestian. It's only medium that we have. The Celestian quilt, hexi ruler. Just check the shank of your machine as you can only use it if yours is a medium shank. Look at your saving though. I mean, that is a brilliant saving. If you want to start your ruler work, if you want to be able to do um, some, some quilting, I can't open the box as it's all sealed, but this is what you're gonna get inside. That's an X-ray vision. Your chin might be different with your foot in. I did. I love a little tin though, that's really nice to keep your foot nice and safe. <laughs> I tell you what, I don't know if I'll ever say that line again. A tin with your foot in. <laughs> that's a tin to keep your foot in. Hello, Christine. Morning, all. It's great to see you still smiling and happy as ever. Oh no, that's the um, other message. That's Christine's other message, isn't it? 
Christine in Dorset's messaging as well. Morning. For old time's sake. Okay, what shall I get? What shall I get Alexa to sing today? Mm, well, miss your bubbliness. Thank you, Christine. Um, oh, I can't think. Right, give me a minute. What songs should we do? Good New Year song. I was thinking of like a sad song, like a. Well, no, actually, no, we've got to keep. What about. See, I was doing annoying songs, wasn't I, over Christmas? And I was making everybody's Alexa go off and really annoying for them. <laughs> right, this is for Hannah. Alexa, play S Club 7, Reach for the Stars. Sorry in advance, that's Hannah. Let me know if it worked, let me know if it worked. Um, if you have got the um, Celestian uh, ru uh, ruler kit set, then these are some more templates. Uh, these are more expansion packs for you. <laughs> Let's go with the curvy one first. Now, it, does this have to fit a certain shank? Because of the depth of the rulers. £13.99, I don't think it does. I think it's just the foot with these ones. You probably know more than us at home. Um, you probably know more than us. <laughs> Thirteen ninety nine down to five pounds sixteen. We've got lots of information, lots of different pieces going around. I think it's just the foot that you need to think about with these ones. But you've got a round, a round in there. You've got like a moon shape, and you've got um, a long octagon sort of shape, rectangle shape. You're going to be able to create loads of shapes with your quilting. It gives you such a professional finish. Um, it, it gives you the look of it being long arm quilted and you can do it on your domestic machine, it's brilliant. If you have got the um, Celestian, if you have got the Celestian kit to start with, then this is another expansion ruler. Has anybody got S Club going on in their house? Thanks to Hannah. It's nothing to do with me, I'll think of a good song. I'm trying to think of another one. Oh, we've got to do an ABBA one, haven't we? We've got to do ABBA. Hello in Greater London. Hi, Vicky. So sad it's your last show. Oh, I know. It really is. It's, I, don't, I don't really... I don't like goodbyes. I'm not very good at goodbyes. So I'll um, try and have a nice few... No, don't... <laughs> She's singing Dame's Blunt. Goodbye, my lover. Um, Happy New Year to everybody. Loved... Hang on. I haven't finished the message. She's clicked off it. Loved everything at Sewing Quarter. Love everything that Sewing Quarter has done. Good luck and thank you. Um, from Sheila. Thank you, Sheila. Another message come through from... Who was that one? Carol. Hello, Carol. Caroline Surrey said, Vic, it started off... Ed Sheeran, how do I say goodbye to you? Not my style, sorry. Hang on, why did I start? Um, Sandra's messaging as well. That was so funny, my Alexa burst her life. At least she listens to you. <laughs> Nobody else does. Nobody else does. There's Han. Oh, this is the, the, um, the, the hat that Annette, Annette lit this for, um, <laughs> we're not selling her. She's 60% off today, but she has sold a scene. Your skin looks great, Hannah. That's the hat that Annette um, knitted for her. Annette, thank you so much for my woolly hat as well. Honestly, I can wear mine every day. Um, that's Paul, by the way. You can follow him on Instagram. You can follow him on Instagram. He's a bit forceful with that, isn't he? Follow him, follow him. Needy, needy. Let's do the Savvy Stripes. Quote as you go. One of our favourites. We love all of these mats. These are brilliant. If you love, if you've got a lot of, um, if you've got a collection, in, for example, that you love, you get to show off so many different prints. You've got your quilting ruler set. This would be a nice one to practice on without having to do all of your piecing and then have a go with your rulers. This is great. Double, of you, double the amount of you have put this straight into your basket that we have available. It was 17 99 It's now 7 20 The seven, six, four left. Two left. 
Go ahead, take it out. <laughs> okay, let's do the scissors with the markings on. These are great because in on the actual blade, um, you can see the centimetres on there. This marked in inches, sorry. This was marked in inches. 19 centimetres or, or how many inches is that? 7.5 inches. It's all marked on the inner blade in inches. Manufactured from the best steel. Do you know, it's weird that you said that. There was a programme last night that the, um, some, one of the, there was an actor on and he said on his last scene he, was, he had to cry and they, they put on some music that was going to be on um, during the, the end scene. And he says, I'm not going to cry to that. You need to put James Blunt, Blunt Goodbye My Lover on and I will cry. And um, you will have heard that song. You will have, Hannah's been singing it for the last 10 minutes. But I thought, oh my word, if I was the actor, I'd be in floods of tears now with that beautiful voice in my ear, Hannah. Eight pounds, your dressmaking scissors. They're really lovely and lightweight as well. I bought Kieran a pair of scissors for Christmas. There you go. Christmas as a married couple. First Christmas uh, as, uh, as a married couple. Yeah, exactly. You remember the story. Kieran cutting my, uh, well, not my bacon, his bacon with my scissors. So I've bought him his own pair of scissors to have in the kitchen now. <laughs> I've written bacon scissors on them. Dressmakers. This is your dressmaking tape. Great to uh, mark your mannequins. Mark where things are, where you want necklines to be. Doesn't leave a sticky residue. It is a specially de developed tape. Seven pounds twenty. It was seventeen ninety nine. Maybe that you know somebody that's studying dressmaking. Planning collars, yokes, pockets, directly onto the dress down instead of onto to fabric, but it won't leave any sticky residue. It's really flexy as well, so you can create curves, you can create definite points. And it's clever, look, it's got the marking. That's a one centimetre marking as you go, so you can also measure as you go. Makes your measuring easy, doesn't it? That's brilliant, I've not seen that before. First time I've seen it. What are you getting, Hannah? Some more walking boots. If anybody's got any in a size four that they'd like to loan Hannah, she needs them for a holiday. She goes on Monday. <laughs> she hasn't actually started packing yet, and so she's going for a whole month. Oh, should we do our Ashmead designs? These are great because you've got um, your EPP kit all in all in one packet. So you've got your nice little foam paper pieces. everything that you need. Your hexi form shapes, your pre-cut fabric pieces, your cushion backing, you've got beads in there, you've got freezer paper and wadding, cushion back lining and your instructions for £5.76. That's a really lovely gift for somebody and Ashmead quality is great as well by the way, it's really really good. Just £5.76, it was £14.40. All the best for 2020. We'll miss you all. Carolyn Northumberland, thank you, Carol. And to you, all the best in 2020 as well. I hope 2020 is going to be a good year for us all. I really hope we'll all meet again. I'm sure we will. Thank you for your message. Um, hello, Rachel. Oh, Rachel Magnolia. Hello, Rachel. Uh, Alexa, play ABBA Dancing Queen. There you go, Rachel. You, I'll do you the dance. So we have to go, we start back to back. And then we go, you could dance, you could dance. That's the routine. No, it's fine, you don't need to get my, my face up close. I'm normally far away on the stage. Sold out. Um, ribbons. Oh, I've stocked up on all of my ribbons during our sales. I can sit down now. Pardon? I thought it might be ribbons in the back. Oh, look at these. Wrapped with love. I've stocked up on my ribbons. 
Hannah and I have been desperate to do a whole ribbon show. We've stocked up on our ribbons, haven't we, in our sale, in the sale. I love this one. I'd like this one as well, please. £6.20, we've absolutely stocked up. Good for Valentine's, isn't it? Especially for you. Rachel, did your, um, did your um, device stop playing ABBA? Oh, I love this. What about somebody getting married? Just for so Oh, my best friend Lauren got engaged on Christmas Eve. I'm so happy for her. I'm so excited. <gasps> I'm, I just love planning weddings and honeymoons. No, not planning honeymoons, planning weddings and uh, Hindus, engagement parties. Oh, so excited. Carol, who had a cheering plane for no apparent reason, has messaged in saying, to be honest, the Alexa's in the kitchen. So, probably misheard me. The Chinese whispers are log. Lisa started to try and play something. She said she's really going to miss us, guys. Thank you very much for your message. Um, <laughs> that's so funny. Mine does that, though. Does yours sometimes, when you're watching the television, just go... You're just thinking you didn't say anything like Alexa or Siri or... I, I, thought, I thought somebody... Um, somebody told me that you can change it. So you can say, oh, Ian or something. Do you know what I mean? You can, say, you can change it to another name. So you can change it to whatever name you want. You don't have one. They don't have one. This would be lovely for bags or home soft furnishing em embellishment. That's lovely, isn't it? Now, I'll tell you what, it is good. It is good to just say, oh, what's the temperature and things like that? <laughs> you do need the information. Um, but for some reason, I don't know if anybody else has had this, because I've put my mum on my account. I got my mum one for Christmas last year. So if I order something, it will send the reminders through to hers. So I was doing my Christmas shopping and it said, your delivery for this, this, this is uh, about to arrive. And my sister texted me saying, just so you know, Vic, we found out this is about to arrive. I'm like, no, I don't know how to stop it from telling my mum what I've got. But um, yeah, and then somebody at a Christmas party started ordering a lot of things on my Alexa <laughs> and rude things as well. And my mum got the memo. <laughs> I've, I've gone really hot. I've gone really, I don't know why I've gone all blushy. It wasn't me. <laughs> no, I cancelled the order straight away. <laughs> I don't know who did it. Paul, 17.99 down to £7.20. This is lovely with the metallic running through, isn't it? <laughs> I haven't seen you since, have I? Seven pounds twenty, seven nine, seventeen ninety nine, down to seven twenty. Paul, you wish you could say the same, don't you? But you can't. Twenty meters of ribbon at such a great price, seven pounds twenty. Okay, can I do the little bag? Because I love this. I've never seen this before. It's from French General. Okay. Oh, it's a fabric tape measure. Ah, oh, look at this. This is a lovely gift for somebody, isn't it? It might not be the most um, accurate tape measure, but it's lovely decorative, isn't it? Really nice and decorative. I, I might not be doing my most precise quilting measurements with this, but um, it's lovely to have. And look, the reverse of it. It is Moda. Oh, yes. Eight pounds and nineteen ninety nine for your motor, and look, it comes in a lovely little drawstring bag. What a lovely gift for somebody! Just eight pounds. It was nineteen ninety nine, and it's now just eight pounds. It's the first time I've seen this. Have you seen this before, Hannah? No, me neither, Paul. It's lovely, isn't it? Let's do the Mariner's Compass. 
Robin Ruth. Okay, this is your fat Robin. It comes with the ruler. Um, and there's loads of expansion packs that you can get. It's definitely worth having a look on their website and seeing what else you can get. But my word, at £20, that is a billy bargain. It was 49 99 Look at all the different sizes. You've got 16 different sizes from 6 inch. It's not to scale. 6 inch to 36 inch with all of your inst instructions as well to create your 16 point compass blocks. The rulers are great as well, they really, really are. It's a really um, solid ruler that will last the test of time with all of your instructions in there and lots of different inspirational ideas for quilt patterns. Ten plate sheet in there as well for your central circle block. Great tips. Tips for lefties as well if you're a left-hander like me. How to get through life, it's a struggle, isn't it, for us? But we're not forgotten in this book, we're not forgotten. It's about to sell out, that is a really, really low price. Okay, we've still got basically everything in that hour has now sold out. I'd have a quick check on the web and see what is still remaining. Don't go anywhere, though, because we're going to do it all again and take everything silly, silly low in just a couple of minutes. I'll see you right after this. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. We're obsessed with designer fabric at Sewing Quarter. From the quirky prints of Tula Pink and K Facet to the more traditional William Morris and Liberty. With our great discounts and capped delivery of just £2.95, who could resist topping up the stash? Check out all the gorgeous fabric we have on offer on our website www.sewingquarter.com and see our top 10 picks on our Pinterest page. It's easy to buy the products you see on our shows. To buy any of the items featured on today's programmes, just head over to our website www.sewingquarter.com. Click on the video stream and you'll be taken to our watch page. Here you'll find the product that is on air right now at the top of the page. Beneath that, you'll find all the products demonstrated in this morning's shows. To add an item to your basket, simply log into your account or register with us. Then you can either check out or keep shopping. Remember, our flat rate delivery charge lets you shop all day and check out as many times as you like and only pay once for postage and packing. Only on Sewing Quarter, Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687. From gorgeous florals to nursery rhyme themed prints and paisley, our Lessienne fabrics are great for all your vintage style makes. And what's more, they're at a discounted price. Visit our website at www.sewingquarter.com to view the full range and discounts. Did you know Sewing Quarter have our very own app? Available to download on all iOS and Android devices. Simply go to the App Store or Google Play and search Sewing Quarter. Once you've downloaded the app, you'll be able to watch Sewing Quarter 24 hours a day and purchase all of the products featured on today's show. So download the app today and keep watching Sewing Quarter on the move. Have you heard about the Sewing Quarter Fans Facebook group? It is a great place to chat to fellow SQ viewers, presenters and guest designers. Share sewing and quilting tips and see what other fans have made. You will even receive exclusive offers and find out about new products and projects before anyone else. Simply search for Sewing Quarter Fans on Facebook to join the group and be part of the SQ community. Follow us on Facebook to see some of our favourite makes that we have coming up, which fabulous guests will be joining us and some of our fantastic offers and discounts. We also hold one-off Facebook Lives with special guests and demonstrations exclusive to Facebook. Just search for Sewing Quarter on Facebook to find us. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. 
head to www.sayingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. Sewing Quarter is the UK's first TV channel dedicated to sewing and quilting. On air and behind the scenes, our team of top industry experts work hard to bring you tons of exciting projects. Whether you're into dressmaking, bag making, piecing, patchworking or quilting, you'll learn something new every day from our talented guest designers and fabulous presenters. Our online shop is packed with tools, haberdashery essentials and fabulous fabrics from simple solids to designer gems. And with our 30-day money-back guarantee and single daily postage charge, you can shop with confidence. So tune in daily on Freeview Channel 73, Sky Channel 687, or, and shop online at sewingquarter.com. Did you know that you can stay up to date with all of Sewing Quarter's demonstrations with our email newsletter? Our newsletter brings you regular updates on what is coming up on the show, as well as exclusive offers, discounts and events we will be at. Be the first to know what's coming up by signing up for our newsletter. You can do all this by heading to our website and clicking on the newsletter button. All we need is your email. Welcome back. Welcome back. It's so lovely to, to have your company today. Uh, my last four hours now with you. So thank you so much uh, for spending the time to say goodbye and say, well, actually, I say I don't like goodbyes. We, we are all obviously going to be um, all over the place. You can still come and see us. At, I know John's going to be at a lot of the shows, as is Tash. You'll see them everywhere. If you want to follow me, I haven't actually done this before ever on air, but um, you probably have known, or I've told you, I've forced it upon you that I sing. So me and Laura, who's our floor manager, Laura's boyfriend, we're in an acoustic duo. And I know quite a few of you have actually come to see us in um, a town near you. If you want to keep up to date with where we are and what we're doing, if you know anyone that's getting married and they want a lovely uh, singer for it, then this is how to follow me. Um, so this is our duo acoustic um, page, which is on Instagram to underscore tone underscore underscore acoustic or on Facebook it's two tone official and you can find us and all of my singing videos are on there do you know I really wanted to do today I wanted to um, bring Andy in us to, and us to do a song um, but sound wise it's quite difficult to do and also um, I don't know what songs we could do without having well without getting into trouble of, of copyright and licensing so if you want to have a watch of me singing as i know uh, quite a few of you jude was saying to me when i saw it at litchfield you've got to come on and sing on your last show so there's videos on there anyway and you can follow and, and keep in contact with me via that um facebook or, or instagram so this hour i want your interactivity come and say hello to us tell me your favorite things about sewing quarter uh, if you've got any questions if you want any help with anything then let us know if we can help you we will uh, we have got, again, so many things that we're going to reduce down to bargain prices this hour. So if you saw the last hour, actually everything sold out. I think the same is going to happen this hour. Where should we start, Hannah? <coughs> we're going to start with, with one of the um, Annie patterns. I did this with Charlotte Newland. It was brilliant. Um, just seeing some of these items that I've got in this last show just bring back so many amazing memories. And I got to work with obviously Charlotte Newland, who was one of our guest designers, a regular guest designer here. But of course, she was the winner of the Great British Sewing Bee. We've worked with so many amazing, talented people. She made one of these for her daughter who went off to university. And then she made one of them for herself um, for her rulers and bits and bobs. But I know her daughter's was for art bits and bobs. Arty bits and bobs, and I think she also made another one for all makeup um, as a makeup and toiletries bag. These are so versatile, but they're really lovely and solid and, and great to store your to store your rulers. You'll need some of your mesh. Uh, I wonder if there's any mesh on the website. If you've already got some in your stash, stock up, but have a quick search and see if there's any on the website. If not, um, you can get that elsewhere. Just two pounds. 
was £12.99. It's now just £2. All of your instructions are in there. Everything that you're going to need on the back of the packet. It will tell you everything that you need. Gone. I'm sorry if you miss out on any of these. It's going to be busy, busy, busy. Should we do the other Annie pattern, which is your um, got your back bag, which is a stylish traveller friendly backpack. Two pounds, two pounds. Stock up your stash while you can. Quick grab padded handle as well as adjustable straps. The bag features a magnetic flap with a front pocket, fully zip quilted pockets on the back, Zipper mesh pocket inside, a numerous inner slip pocket, everything to keep everything uh, everything organised. <laughs> oh, Hannah, please, will you keep me updated on all of your love stories, all of your uh, just all of your lovely um, <laughs> all of your lovely stories. <sighs> Hannah has the best dating stories and I will miss them dearly. Please keep in contact with me. Two pounds. <laughs> Was 12 99 down to just two pounds. All of the Annie's patterns are always very, very popular indeed. What are you like? Is that about to go? About to go. Uh, let's do Anna Maria Horner. Is that okay? I've got the artist bag. This one will suit you, Han. You can also make the clutch. Clutch bag as well. Two patterns in one. <laughs> Escape for the weekend or just the evening with an escape artist bag or clutch. That's a lovely big bag, isn't it? To keep all your oldie bits in. Or what about as like um, a farmer's market bag? Maybe you do embroidery and you've got, you could do a full embroidery design at the front, couldn't you? Or Sashko or a panel on the front there. Or if you love a certain designer and you love, um, you know, some of the big prints of Tula maybe or William Morris and that would look amazing with this. Two pounds! This is just silly really, isn't it? I mean, I've got the photo printing paper that I got from the, um, from the clearance and um, you could put a photograph, couldn't you? I could put Hannah's face on there or John's face on there. I think I'm going to put John Scott's face on there. I'll put John's face. Um, I love to hear all of your love stories. I want a picture of you and your uh, new... Yeah. <laughs> your artist tote bag, Anna Maria Horner. See, this is another designer that we've been very, very privileged to have here in the studio. There's three, three practical bag options here. So you've got option A, B and C. Everyone's got the lurgy, haven't they, over Christmas? I um, luckily just managed to shake it off in time. About the week before, I was, oh, not good, not good. I just was like, no, I refuse to get ill. Refuse, refuse, refuse. Put Vic all over me, Vic's vocal rub on that. I woke up and thought, I can breathe. It's a lovely feeling, isn't it? Well, Paul. Paul's been ever so poorly. <laughs> he's actually poorly, though, he's saying. OK. The Happy Wanderer bag. Finished product is 15 inches by 14 inches. Oh, this is cute. Look at that, it's like a drawstring bag, a useful little bag. Two options that you can have it as a, like a, a drawstring bag or as a knapsack. What's a knapsack? What's a knapsack bag? What's a knapsack bag, Tom? So you can have it as a drawstring bag 
option as a knapsack or as a drawstring? I suppose you could just do that as a block, couldn't you? You could have that as a cushion front or as a centre of a quilt block. That's really cute. I'd do some lovely embroidery on there as well. A uh, hiker's bag with shoulder straps, apparently that's what um, Google says. Uh, do you know what? We rely on this so much, don't we? Uh, if Google ever goes down, well, I'm, I'm, I, knew, I know probably six things, maybe seven <laughs> things, that's it. <laughs> if it goes down, I, I'm pretty much, I don't know what to do. I, I must know six things. <laughs> I can't even name six things that I know. <laughs> What are the six things that I know I saved it to Google, yeah. <gasps> My word. I don't know how to boil an egg. Still, even after so many of you emailed me really helping how to do a soft boiled egg and a poached egg, need to get Mary Berry's egg cookbook, don't I? A singing egg? What do you mean? There's a thing that looks like an egg, that looks like an egg, and it sings a different tune when it reaches a different point of, what do you mean a different point of egg? A soft board or a hard board has a different point of song. That's a good, that's a good invention actually, isn't it? I had some of those poaching pods, still don't help. They don't help, or it takes you longer, doesn't it? When you find a singing egg, please will you um, send me the link? <laughs> I'll get one. I've never heard of them, have you? So yes, that's, Definitely not one of the six things that I know. Stop Googling things. We could do things without Google. Your music sampler. Your cross stitch. Oh my word, it's very expensive for a singing egg. But it, it just nine pounds forty. It was twenty-three pounds fifty. If music be the food of love, play on. Twelfth Night, the opening line. Isn't it the opening line of Twelfth Night, actually? That's one of the six things I know. And you've got your counted... Um, you've got all of your stranded cotton and you've got your... Um, is it on Ada? Yeah, Ada. Pre-sorted thread, wrap needles, chart and instructions. What does it sing, I wonder? I wonder if it sings like an actual song, like, um, um, I was trying to think of a funny one, and I'll, I'll see it again. How do you like your eggs in the morning? Or something like that, yeah. Nine pounds 40. What would you have if you were inventing the singing egg? What song would you have? Elvis is an Elvis one. That one's 16 pounds. I'd like that one, it sings Elvis. Do you know who I've really got into over the last few days, over the festive season? Roy Orbison. You got his album for Christmas? You bought it a couple of months ago. I love Roy Orbison, he's got such a lovely voice. I didn't realise he sings, anything you want, you got it. I love that song. Sorry, we're going back to the egg, the Elvis egg. It sings, Viva Las Vegas for softboard eggs. And a hound dog for semi-hard boiled eggs. Then Jail's house rocked for the perfect hard boiled egg. Whoever invented that, I bet they're just... Yeah. <laughs> they are rolling in it, aren't they? I'd pay £16 for that now, actually. I thought it was quite expensive, but that's good. £9.40. Maybe that's another album you could lend me. A few years ago, he lent me a um, Barry White CD for the car, and I think Paul's going to lend me the Roy Orbison one now. <laughs> Thanks. Soft board eggs smoke on the water. I was made for loving you for the perfect boil egg. Medium. And then the final countdown for hard board eggs. Oh, brilliant. I'm definitely getting one of those.
nine pounds 40 I, I must say paul i've worked with how long have i known you now paul paul and i have um and he's been a real good wingman to me he has been a good wingman i've now become married i'm trying to for you look here we go let's put your instagram again it's difficult if anybody's single i'm being a good wingman for paul if anybody's single drop him a message the underscore duke at one 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 Hannah's found another good egg. And now we're not talking about um, Paul. The soft boiled eggs is killing me softly. That's the way I like it, is the semi hard boiled egg. And then the perfect hard boiled egg is oh happy day. So you put it in the boiling water with the egg, it looks like an egg, but when it gets to that point, it sings the song. When it, sings, when it gets to the temperature, I guess. So clever. So there you go. That's my answer to the perfect egg. I've been really upset again over Christmas that I still can't do it. Um, should we do a little um, bag frame, purse frame? No, please do. It's really good. I love these songs. I like the Killing Me Softly one and then it goes into, um, it's the final countdown. So obviously you can have it with or without the straps. £9.99 to just £4 now. Great value for money. Oh, and we love these. These ones, I wonder whether... So these are your glue-in ones, aren't they? These are your glue-in ones. £9.99, that lovely antique bronze for just £4. So what does it sing? Oh, oh, what, sorry? There's one that's like a Western theme. I think there's a pirate-themed singing egg. Hannah's got really into this singing egg thing. I think you should contact them and try and become one of their ambassadors. She's really into these singing eggs. You'll see her at the um, next Knitting and Stitching show where you go to the, any of the, the shows that she'll be there with the, with the singing eggs. Mainly available in Germany, she's going to bring it to the UK market. There's a gap in the market, isn't there? Please leave a message in if you've got a singing egg, because I've never heard anybody to have a singing egg. But we think there's a gap in the market. 9 99 down to just £4. Okay. Um, what would you like to do, Hannah? Cross stitch book with the budgies. Absolutely. Oh, this is great. Our last cross stitch book sold out. And this is going to do the same. It's less than five pounds. If you see something you like, you've got to add it to your order and check out as soon as you can. If you're watching on any sort of replay, it's definitely worth calling the customer service team and finding out availability. But um, chances are. A lot of these will have sold out. <laughs> oh, look at the mermaid and your anchor. Dinosaur, moustache, headphones. Oh, what's this? Is it what, sorry? Is it an eye wall? Is it? Oh, I love it. Message for Paul. Paul. Morning, Vicky. Yes, I am single. Uh, I don't think I'm the one for Paul, though. I'm 72, Margaret in Leeds. That's fine. That's fine. Do you like an older lady? Oh, Margaret, I think we could set this up. This is Margaret in Leeds. I think we could make it work, you know. Just, it's just long distance, isn't it? It's not the age thing. It's, um, it's, it's the long distance relationship. Uh, £4.99. Thank you for your messages. Keep them coming in. It, Paul's saying that I've not been a very good wingman. Oh, look at this. <laughs> buttons. Cross-stitch buttons. Lots of lovely projects in here and very useful projects as well. Great gift ideas for people. Look at all the dogs. 
mini samplers, traditional samplers. Eye mask, this is cool, isn't it? I am awake. Pop art canvases. There is a lot of projects in here. Watch straps. Tote bag. Look with the dinosaur. So you don't need to, I think a lot of people think, oh, uh, you know, you cross stitch, it needs to be something that then hangs on the wall. But why not incorporate it into a bag or onto an apron or onto a cushion or onto something else? You could just pick one of the smaller motifs uh, and transfer it onto a pair of shoes. Look, a real simple pair of, um, of pumps. Plimp soles. Pair of jeans. Denim jackets. That's such a good idea, how to upcycle. And I love to personalise and upcycle. And I love looking at all these dogs. Look at this. You don't get the dogs included, but it's cute to look at, isn't it, whilst you read your instructions. Peter Pan collar. That's cute, isn't it, with your owl? And then you've also got some um, paper there, some grid to do your own designs. There's loads and loads. I mean, I've just really quickly flicked through there, but there's loads and loads. All the different tools, all the different stitches that you need, how to cross stitch, which stitches you need, how to back stitch, how to start and finish, where to start and finish. Will you stop using Google, please? I'm trying to prove that we can move five hours without it. They're lovely, aren't they? You've got alphabets in here as well. Alphabets and numbers. Just four pound ninety nine for the amount of um, for the amount of motifs you have in here. That's brilliant. Is that like a prawn? Yeah, it's a prawn. <laughs> or a langoustine. It, so this is great for a complete beginner, somebody who doesn't has never done cross stitch before. Really good place to start, and I suppose expand your skills as well. There's loads that you're going to be able to do in here. Four pounds on time. We're getting loads of messages from Paul. So, Paul, I don't think you can tell me that I haven't tried. Um, lots of lovely, lovely messages. Mo in the Highlands. Hannah says she absolutely adores you, Mo. She says I love you, Mo. Um, Margaret Inley, there's nothing wrong with being 62, no way. No, it's uh, 72, sorry, it's only 60 plus VAT. <laughs> I love that, that is brilliant. No, you're right, that's really close, isn't it? Or I like to see it's, you know, it's like being 40 with, with 32 years experience, Margaret. 40 with 32 years experience. Mo, you're absolutely right, absolutely right. Nothing wrong with that. How old are you, Paul? Right, he's 37. 37. There's some beautiful designs in here, isn't there? Lucy's been ever so poorly, you know. Not like you, Paul. She's been actually poorly poor. OK, taking the graphics out. At the moment, you've still got a chance. I'm going to keep that up there so you can remember that's less than five pounds, which is brilliant. Sh if you've got your cross stitch, should we do some um, Ada? I've got Ada and I've got linen, actually. Let's do the Ada um, DMC. Oh, you get a free chart in inside. You get a free design in there. I think it might be this one. And it will tell you as well what colours, what DMC strand you'll need just two pounds can you boil an egg though Hannah without one and she just likes the whole singing thing was 4.99 it's now two pounds the singing egg does it play it clearly or is it like one of those old MIDI keyboards that's like ding 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 Do you know what I mean? It's not the best version, it's not actually Elvis singing You ain't on but hell dark It's the tune on like a, a, a MIDI keyboard, I'm with you Sold out Your linen 
I'd like to be one of the singers in your new invention, yeah. Well, it's not an invention, it's already being done. <laughs> How much was this, by the way? Was fourteen ninety nine, and it comes with a free happy birthday charge as well. Six pounds. A hundred percent, a hundred percent linen. It would still turn out exactly the same size. It's just a difference. Um, it's just uh, the difference of it's a smaller, smaller weave. It was fourteen pounds. That's a big reduction, isn't it? Just six pounds. From Belfast as well, which is one that Jane Greenoff absolutely recommends this one. So it's the best that you can get. So if you want to try some beautiful, it looks more, um, it looks more antique doesn't it? Sixteen count, hundred percent linen, beautiful pink. This is again. Your happy birthday chart as well. Your free chart is included. It was fourteen ninety nine. It's six pounds today. Sixty two, sorry, thirty two count. One hundred percent linen. It's a nineteen inch by twenty seven inch. Lovely for all of your embroidery techniques. It, is, it doesn't necessarily just have to be cross stitch actually. Sixteen ninety nine down to just six pounds. Please don't forget to check out of your basket. I know there's loads of you that have got these um, sitting there in, in your baskets, but it's not yours until you check out. You can check out as many times as you want. It still doesn't affect your posting packaging. You'll still only pay one P and P, which is brilliant, isn't it? Absolutely brilliant. Happy New Year, everybody! By the way, it's my last show with you today. I don't like goodbye, so say goodbye. We don't like goodbye. So we're just going to have a lovely four hours. Message in, send in your messages. Uh, if you want to ask us any questions, of course, we're live on air until the 30th. Our last day is the 30th. So if you've got any questions, do you want to say hello? Um, Merry Christmas. If you want to tell us if you've got a, a singing... Hannah's asking if you've got any singing egg timers at home. She's really, really getting into the idea of having a singing egg timer. A singing egg timer business, I should say. Okay, let's do all of these different colour threads. This is great for your embroidery. And these are great packets as well. Jane Greenoff says about these because you literally just snip at the bottom and you pull them out so you don't get tangled and they stay all dust free. They're really, really good. I'm not allowed to open them, otherwise I would show you how it opens. But it's got... Um, instructions on the back there that you can see you just snip in the bottom and you pull it out Jane Green I've bought these to us these are your Madeira threads okay are we doing this one by one pink this is the only pink 40 pence oh lowest price ever got to be the lowest price we've ever done at sewing quarter I'd be buying 10 of these if I were you Absolutely. You'd have 100 metres then. Oh, it'd be £4. That'd be so good. Absolutely brilliant. No, I mean, um, well, there's, there's, there's just nothing to say. You know Jane Greenoff. Um, for her to recommend a thread, you know that it's, it's really good quality. Uh, it's great to be able to just have 10 metres in there ready to go. If you're taking this on the move, it's lovely. 40 pence for your embroidery floss, your baby pink colour, for just 40 pence. She 
Shall we go to... You pick a number, Hannah. Chartreuse. Oh, there's certain words that I can only say in an accent, and that is one of them. That was Scottish. Sorry to all of our Scottish viewers if I just offended you with my, all, my, my awful accent. There's another one, what else can't I say without doing in an accent? Um, I can't remember. Chartreuse. 99 pence down to 40 pence for 10 metres. That's a lovely spring green, isn't it? That's a really lovely spring green. I'm thinking of some of the designs from our, um, from our cross stitch. Let's have a look and see where we could use our green. There's loads. This is something that's going to go a really long way. Oh, what about some lovely green eyes on your eye mask? Look at the kitty. Um, my sister bought me one for Christmas that's got like a lavender in it. You know, like one of those beaded ones. Oh, it's lovely. The ones that you can put in the freezer. You can put them in the freezer or in the fridge and just put it on and it's really soothing for your eyes. Has anybody else had very, um, I think it's from the weather. I feel like I've got really, really dry eyes. I've had like a... Um, uh, dry eyes burning like fire. That's not, what is, what's the word? What's the actual lyric? It's not dry eyes, is it? Bright eyes, bright eyes. Not dry eyes. Oh gosh, that's a zero three. Um, that's a really sad film, isn't it? That's a really sad film, Watership Down. But no, this eye mask's lovely. Soothing my dry eyes. Forty pence for ten meters, and it is really handy. Your instructions on the back that it will keep it dust lint free if you're just pulling from the bottom of the packet. It's designed great, and it will mean as well that you don't get in a tangle. You don't lose them. You keep them all together, and you won't lose it. Or if you're on the move, then this is great, isn't it? If you're doing a bit of hand stitching on the go, on the train or something, you haven't got threads all you know, getting in the way of everything and everyone. 40 pence. Um, I always end up with getting little bits of thread all over me. So this is handy to just have, just like your little dispenser as well. What we like, eh? Carry on going through for all of these. Do you know, this is the top that I wore for my very first show here on Sewing Quarter. My patchwork top. First ever show I wore this and last. Um, should we go to number mossy green? Gosh, I'm being very quick with this. Like a lovely mossy green. Was 99 down to 40 pence. I don't think I've ever said that. In my history of shopping television, I've never said 40 pence. Brilliant. Looks wrong, doesn't it, on the screen? It does look wrong. There's lots of you multi-buying on these. I'm not surprised. Well done to everybody who's checking out. Your embroidery floss, 10 metres of your bay leaf colour for just 40 pence. It was 99, which is already brilliant. Luckily, we have got um, quite a large stock, which is great. 10 metres for 40 pence. Half the stock of these have gone. I'm thinking when we're getting into the springtime, I'm really looking forward to spring now. I'm excited to actually, I know that we're only a couple of days after Christmas, but I can't wait to take all my decks down and have a really good spring cre uh, clean in, in January. Oh yeah, we'll all be fine, don't you worry. We'll, um, we'll all meet again in the spring. Meet again, don't know where. I love that song. Some sunny day. There's Paul. If you want to um, follow him on Instagram. Oh. <laughs> There's me, by the way, if you want to follow um, me on, on Facebook or Instagram. It's my, um, 
It's my uh, acoustic duo I'm in. It's called Two Tone Acoustic. I know that Judith has come and seen us in Litchfield last week. It was really good to meet her. Um, well, I've, I've met Judith a few times now, but of course, you can see where if we're coming to a town near you, come see us. If you want to follow Hannah whilst she goes on her trip to Burma, patterns and place, travel photography, you can follow her. There is a link on there for our, um, our normal Instagram, but this is all of her holiday pics. Okay, should we do another green one? Yeah. Another lovely light green. 99 pence down to 40 pence for your embroidery floss. 10 metres. Yeah, maybe you've been looking for love for so... Sorry, I was just thinking, it's just hit me. Do you know what? I was just thinking, you've been looking for love for all of these years and it's literally sitting right beside you, perhaps, Paul. Perhaps love is sitting right beside you, Paul. Oh, come on, let's set Hannah and Paul up. Has that even ever been mentioned? 40 pence. It's not like it's going to be weird because you work together. <laughs> 40 pence for 10 metres of your embroidery floss. <gasps> Come on, let's set it trending. Hello, Mo. Oh, I've got Margaret in Leeds. Oh, no, 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 I haven't. No. Maury, I haven't got you. Oh, yes, I have. Hi to everyone at Sewing Quarter. I've been watching from the first show and I can't believe it's ending. I know, we're all really sad. Um, it's ending. Happy New Year, everyone. Um, thank you, Marie. That's a lovely message, thank you. Happy New Year to you too in Devon. Whereabouts in Devon are you? We travel down to Appledore a lot, which is um, north Devon. Barnstable's near Appledore, isn't it? And um, Westwood Ho. Westwood Ho, this lovely part of the world, isn't it, Devon? I think this year I want to see more of the UK, like go down to Cornwall in the summer as well. Um, let's go for, yeah, 10 metres, 89, snip at the bottom, remember, and pull, dispense from the bottom, so you can have, <laughs> sorry, I, I was just practising in case I want to be an air hostess, changing career, so what you do, dispense from the bottom, take a snip, and then exit here and here. <laughs> Pardon? Yes, do you know what? Somebody told me, I'm going to Australia in um, uh, April and they said that you can ask to sit next to the exit door and then obviously they come up to you and they say, right, in an emergency, you're okay to act, do all this. But you get extra leg room, don't you? I'm definitely going to request that because um, I can put my air hostess skills to the test as well. Whilst they're starting to do it, I might stand up and... Oh, can I not stand up whilst they're doing the safety things and I'm not part of it? Oh, I thought if you sit next to the door that you have to participate. I'm not part of the team. Oh gosh, that's a good idea, isn't it? Thirty-two? Have you got 32, Hannah? Looks very, very similar to the last one. This time it's in what colour? Coal. Oh, the name of this colour is 1703. Lots of different shades of green. Somebody who, um, who's naming the shades of greens obviously um, had this one near the end and thought, oh, 1703, just put the number. I can't think of another shade of green. Let's call it moss. No, it didn't. Oh, we called the other one. You called the other one moss, but it was actually called um, bay leaf. 40 pence. All about the price, 10 metres. For, for, for just 40 pence. Um, we managed to get this in, especially from um, Jane Greenoff, so you know the quality of it as well. 
Stock up your stash whilst you can. Stock up your stash. It, it, it is about to sell out. 73. Uh, so last year, okay, 73. <laughs> what were you doing this time last year? I love seeing what we were doing. It's a, a weird Saturday today, isn't it? It is a weird Saturday. It's that strange bit between Christmas and New Year. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing these few days. Have you been at work? Have you gone back to work? Have you been? Uh, have you got any more food shopping to do? Or are you still just eating bubble and squeak? Forty pence for your lovely green in colour shade one five zero four. Great thing about Madeira as well is if you love this particular colour shade and if you want to go to Madeira to buy more, then you know it's going to match. <laughs> don't worry, you don't need to go all the way to Madeira to buy more. But if you go to their website and you want to get that colour, then um, you know it's going to be consistent and you're not going to lose the packet. It's kept in the packet, so you know what colour it is. Quite often, if you've if you've used you know a skein, you've taken the packaging off. You can't remember what number that is can you we've got a couple of other um oh three we've got a couple of other shades of green two more it's nice to have the different shades because not all haberdashery shops will stock all of these many different shades of green especially if you're doing floral this is great different tones for florals and leaves Forty pence. Forty pence, you can't go wrong, and that's a lovely forest green, isn't it? Oh look, they actually had a colour for this one. This one's called Bottle Green. 12. 12. Yeah. 40p. 40p. 10 metres for 40 pence. multi on this. I think even a Fredo now costs more than that nowadays, doesn't it? No. <laughs> No, but Freddo's have gone up in, that's what it feels like. I feel like Freddo has, um, I feel like Freddo's gone and got a mortgage and he's got his bills to pay or something and he's just gone up in price. Yeah, I swear it used to be a 5p or something. And now it's, isn't it 25 pence now for Freddo? Crazy. 40 pence though. If you go even for a chocolate bar, most chocolate bars are more than this, aren't they? Oh, it's annoying when you go to the service stations and you think, oh, just fancy a bank of crisps or a chocolate bar and it's like £10. <laughs> They're really expensive, aren't they? 99 pence. Although I do like, um, my favourite service station is at Gloucester. If you live in Gloucester, you've got a lovely service station. On Governor's Station on Christmas Day, I was waiting for them. I was thinking, I've had this conversation so many times with my favourite service stations and they started having the conversation. I thought, they're going to say Gloucester. But no, need to go to Nutsford though for my, uh, they're going a different route, aren't they? But I'd love to go to Nutsford for an egg and cress sandwich now. They've got to do some sort of campaign around egg and cress sandwiches, haven't they, to, to make the most of that. Um, let's go to our more golden shades. I'm going to go to 49. We've got four different shades of, of beigey golds. If you're Birmingham way or you're going down towards... Um, Devon or Bristol, yeah, Gloucester's a good one. If you're going towards London, I always stop at, um, where's the big, big service station? It's an extra one, oh, it's fabulous. <laughs> 99 pence down to 40 pence today. Massive reductions on everything. Clearing out the stock. Very sad times, but um, all good things must come to an end, of course. No, it's sad, isn't it? 
But we absolutely have had the best time here. We really, really have. I've, personally, it's, it's been such an amazing journey for me. I've learned so much, so, so much. Marjorie in Suffolk. Um, Oh, which part of Oz are you going to? We're going in March. Oh, amazing. Thanks for all your fun on sewing quarter. So I'm going up to Byron Bay for a wedding. Fly to Brisbane. Um, and then it's in Byron Bay. So we're staying with uh, Kieran's family up there. And then we're traveling down to Sydney and having a couple of days there. And then Kieran's got more family over in um, Perth. So we fly to Perth for, again, a couple of days. I'll be away in total for uh, just under three weeks. So hopefully getting to see, because this will be the only time I ever get the chance to go over to, yeah, over, go, over to Australia. So it'll be so good. Yes, our, our best man from our wedding is getting married this year. So it'll be lovely. Very excited. Never been, and I don't think I would ever go, if I'm honest. I'm not, and I would love to, don't get me wrong, but I, I just is the flight that I think terrifies, not terrifies me, but it's a long way, stopping on the way. We're going to stop at Dubai and we're having a night there. So that'll break it up. Because I know a lot of the, obviously, planes, they, they stop, but don't they, but for a few hours. Okay. 99p down to 40 pence. Where are you going? Let me know. Let me know where you're going. Uh, Mo says, nonsense, Vic. You don't want to go to Western Ho, Westwood Ho, come to the Highlands and the Islands with Hannah. Oh, yes, we'd love to. We'd love to, Mo. We'd love to come. Um, you'll love it. Don't invite Hannah too much. She will just turn up. Do you know what? Eric lives up there. Our friend Eric, he lives um, up in, in Glasgow, but his family live up in the Highlands, and I'd love to go. My mom went, uh, Dad, they used to travel to the Isle of Skye and um, the Loch Lomond and all around there, but I've never been. I'd love to go. To Inverness. Inverness. My parents went to watch Inverness Caledonian Thistles, the football team up there. <laughs> <laughs> Mo, we'd love to come and visit you. We'll, um, we'll set a date. This time of year, but it's magical. Let's go 43, Hannah. Scotland's one of my favourite places, though. I've quite often been to Edinburgh for New Year, and I love it. 40 pence. Yes, thank you. Stop saying that, Paul. I was like, this is it, the last show with you, Vix. Ah. Oh. 40 pence. I'm just taking it all in. What an amazing journey it's been. Oh, honestly, I feel like I did a whole production line of aprons for a big UK company. The amount of aprons I made on my first month here of sewing quarter was crazy. I was like, oh, this is brilliant. Everyone, who could I make an apron for? Although I was quite pleased, actually. I went to um, Kieran's aunt and uncle's um, on Boxing Day. Straight away, they went, right, put your apron on and gave me one of the aprons that I made. I was like, do you remember I made this for you? They actually, it was useful. It was used. My mum also reminded me that she sent hers back. And I said, Mum, I know. I talk about it on air all the time. She's like, it wasn't really, um, wasn't really that good, was it? I got your apron out as well on Christmas Day. Um, Paul, Paul um, got me an April, uh, an April, an apron for Christmas. It's a sequined one, full sequin. <laughs> you know those ones that change colour as you brush them? Or push up and down, as, as Paul's just described. You know, those aprons that you push up and down. 40 pence. What did you get for Christmas this year, Paul? Nice bits and bobs. Useful bits and bobs. Me and Kieran, you can tell we're married now. I had an extension lead. <laughs> that was probably my favourite gift. It, it will be used. It's very, very useful. Uh, what else did I have? It's all really useful things. I bought him some scissors. Um, I also bought him some new toothbrush heads. You got an electric toothbrush. Oh, next year you might be getting some toothbrush heads then. It's exciting. Number 14. I did do a, I did do him a nice album with all photos, our wedding photos though. That was a nice present. 14, um, number 14, this is colour 1108. It's like a lovely turquoisey blue, isn't it? Like our sewing quarter blue. Matches in nicely with the graphics. 
10 meters. Multi by multi by multi by at 40p. We're going to squeeze in the rest of these before the end of the hour. Anything that we don't get a chance to do, we will move over into the next hour. I've got another shade of blue, slightly different. I'll put it next to it so you can see, because if I do that, then it, it looks like it's the same one. It's not slightly lighter, more of a sky blue. This is 85. Okay, 99 pence down to 40 pence. I'm taking it that nobody in the country has got a singing egg. Nobody's messaged. And also, nobody wants to go on a date with Paul. <laughs> oh, my word. Uh, the same kind of popularity. Maybe like, maybe like the singing egg, you'd be more popular in Germany. And where else is the singing egg from? Where else can you get a singing egg? In Germany and... Um, there you go, that's how you follow Hannah, that's how you follow me, and that's how you follow Paul. Where did you say the singing eggs are mostly popular, Hannah? They seem to be a lot in Germany. And Hannah had one when she was in Holland. Maybe you've got more of a chance in Holland and Germany then, Paul. Yeah, for dates. <laughs> Number 30 is your deep royal blue. I think love could be right beside you. I don't know why we've overlooked this for so long. Forty P. Ten meters. Ten meters down to forty P. That is a beautiful velvety blue, isn't it? Great for all styles of embroidery, not just your cross stitch. About to sell out. We've got two pink shades, two other pinky shades. 67, which is the lighter, and then the other one, look, you can see the difference. Lovely. We'll go with the salmon. What's everybody doing for New Year's? New Year's Eve. Are you going to a party? Will you see the New Year in? Can you believe that Robbie Williams' track, Millennium, is 20 years old? 20 years old! Can you remember where you were for the millennium? What were you doing? Did you do a time capsule? Did you do a time capsule? I think a lot of people did a time capsule, didn't they, for the millennium? I don't know when they're going to um, dig that up. We did one at school, yeah. I remember my parents, um, we used to have lots of pubs when I was little, so we had the best party, I remember, because I was, I was little, I was young, I was about 10. So um, to go down to the pub and enjoy the party was like a rare occasion for me and my sister. So my sister's friend came and curled on my hair and I wore a big, long purple dress with all feathers all on it. Oh, it was amazing. That was probably the first big party that I can remember for the millennium. Singing Robbie Williams' Millennium, that was 20 years ago. Not to make us all feel old. Where were you, Paul? Last one. This is it, the last one. Ten metres for 40p. Well done, everybody who secured all of these Madeira threads. They're really lovely quality. Remember to dispense from the bottom. <laughs> Do make sure you're checking out on all of the items from this show. It's been busy, 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 busy. Do we have time to just um, do one more? We've got three minutes. Should we do some snap fasteners? We've done lots of threads, though. We can do some threads in the next hour, can't we? There's loads of you checking out on those. Well done if you got them. We will bring you some more of, of the threads in the next hour. Anything that we didn't get a chance to do. These are your 20 assorted sizes. £1.50 was the price. They're now 60p. 
I think these are great for things like um, purses, little flaps, little compartments, glasses, cases, organisers. 60p. You know, if you're doing any of the, the bag pants that we saw earlier on, quite often they'll have little um, flaps on the bags that you could use just some little snap fastenings. 60p. Well done, everybody. And nice, nice different sizes as well. What about for children's clothes? Poppers. These are quick and easy, aren't they? To the buttons. 60p. Well done. Uh, they're about to sell out. They are about to sell out. Let's do the other D ring. So we've got 30 millimetres and 20 millimetres. These are 30. 30 millimetre D rings. If you've got any, if you're making your own bag straps, adjustable bag straps. If you're doing, um, well, attaching anything to your, to your bags or, it's perfect. Just good to stock up on your bag haberdashery, isn't it? They're from Prim. Four of them, they were 2 pounds they're now £1.20. We've then got the, the uh, smaller D-rings as well. 20 millimetres. One pound twenty was two ninety nine. It's now just one twenty. How are you going to be spending a new year then, Hannah? If you're going to be in Burma, hopefully you'll have got to your friend's house by then. She arrives in Yangon, Yangon in um, at two o'clock in the afternoon. So hopefully you'll be able to find your friend's house by. They're staying somewhere else. Okay. Right. So how, how far is it to where your friend, you're going to be able to make it for the things. Okay, so you're not far. Amazing. Next day she's on a night bus. How long for? I don't know. It's a long way. 2 99 for £1.20 today. That's so exciting. She's just booking it as she goes. Okay. Um, anything else that we haven't got a chance to do, don't worry. We will uh, transfer into the next hour. Thank you, Lucy. Well, don't go anywhere, though. We are going to continue with our warehouse clearance in a couple of minutes. Thank you for all of your messages. Stay with us. We've still got a few more hours to get some bargains in right after this. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. We're obsessed with designer fabric at Sewing Quarter. From the quirky prints of Tula Pink and K Facet to the more traditional William Morris and Liberty. With our great discounts and capped delivery of just £2.95, who could resist topping up the stash? Check out all the gorgeous fabric we have on offer on our website www.sewingquarter.com and see our top 10 picks on our Pinterest page. It's easy to buy the products you see on our shows. To buy any of the items featured on today's programmes, just head over to our website www.sewingquarter.com. Click on the video stream and you'll be taken to our watch page. Here you'll find the product that is on air right now at the top of the page. Beneath that, you'll find all the products demonstrated in this morning's shows. To add an item to your basket, simply log into your account or register with us. Then you can either check out or keep shopping. Remember, our flat rate delivery charge lets you shop all day and check out as many times as you like and only pay once for postage and packing. 
Only on Sewing Quarter, Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687. From gorgeous florals to nursery rhyme themed prints and paisley, our Lessien fabrics are great for all your vintage style makes. And what's more, they're at a discounted price. Visit our website at www.sewingquarter.com to view the full range and discounts. Did you know Sewing Quarter have our very own app? Available to download on all iOS and Android devices. Simply go to the App Store or Google Play and search Sewing Quarter. Once you've downloaded the app, you'll be able to watch Sewing Quarter 24 hours a day and purchase all of the products featured on today's show. So download the app today and keep watching Sewing Quarter on the move. Have you heard about the Sewing Quarter Fans Facebook group? It is a great place to chat to fellow SQ viewers, presenters and guest designers. Share sewing and quilting tips and see what other fans have made. You will even receive exclusive offers and find out about new products and projects before anyone else. Simply search for Sewing Quarter Fans on Facebook to join the group and be part of the SQ community. Follow us on Facebook to see some of our favourite makes that we have coming up, which fabulous guests will be joining us and some of our fantastic offers and discounts. We also hold one-off Facebook Lives with special guests and demonstrations exclusive to Facebook. Just search for Sewing Quarter on Facebook to find us. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. Did you know that you can stay up to date with all of Sewing Quarter's demonstrations with our email newsletter? Our newsletter brings you regular updates on what is coming up on the show, as well as exclusive offers, discounts and events we will be at. Be the first to know what's coming up by signing up for our newsletter. You can do all this by heading to our website and clicking on the Newsletter button. All we need is your email. Welcome back, welcome back to a, uh, you know, a bittersweet day. It's been an amazing journey, but it is my last three hours with you now. Thank you so much for all of my new followers, by the way. It's exciting. This, I know I get why Paul keeps putting up his Instagram things. It's great. Um, thank you so much. I've had a lovely message from um, a few ladies, actually, who have said that they, they, they live in the area as well, so they're looking forward to coming and see me at my gigs. Uh, we do loads all over, so do follow us. On Facebook, it's at Two Tone Official. That's Andy, by the way. That's Laura's boyfriend. That's Laura. Uh, well, we were hoping they were getting engaged this Christmas. I can't put pressure. Um, but yeah, they're lovely. I think everyone thought that was going to happen. They're so lovely. They are lovely. Um, and yeah, it will happen. They've just got their house together. You know, can't put any pressure on him, but he's, he's you know, he will one day. Um, and this is Paul, who also, we're not putting the pressure on, but we're looking to get him engaged as well. Uh, follow him on Instagram, follow him on Instagram. But no, thank you for all of your, um, my new followers. Very exciting. So we mainly put all of our gigs that are up and coming on our Facebook, but then we'll also be quite, um, Andy tends to do all the Instagram as well, but you can message me on there and um, keep in touch with us. Do you want to see Hannah? Hannah's going to Burma on, uh, on the 30th. She's going to, to Burma on Monday. She's still, got, she's still yet to pack, but if you want to follow her story, you'll probably see her vacuuming her, her um, suitcase on there in the next day. She says, I've just got it down from the loft and it's very dusty. And I've got to do all of my packing. She's away for a month, so we can see her travels all on her Instagram. So you can still keep in touch with us, even though we won't be, you know, here on air every day. Um, we're still all on social media, so please do follow us. And I'm sure you'll still see see um, a lot of us on the telev television screens again. Obviously, sign up for John Scott's Sewing World. I'm sure you will see him on, on your television screens very, very soon. 
And lots of our guest designers as well are going to be involved um, with John Scott's Sewing World. So you never know, he might get me and you on as a guest, Hannah. You never know, you never know. I've asked, he said no. No, I'm only joking. Right, this takes me back to last year, last Christmas, last Christmas. Oh no, can't carry on with the rest of that song, it'll make us cry. Um, our llama uh, sort of addiction started, didn't it, Hannah? Hannah and I, were, we both got llama um, walking trips for, well, Hannah got one for her, for her mum and dad. My sister got one for me. Uh, Paul got me a Sew Your Own Llama kit for Christmas last year. I've got a Christmas llama jumper. Uh, everything, we were all llamaed out by, um, by the end of 2018. But, have you got room for one more llama in your life? A very useful llama as well, because it's a pincushion. <laughs> or, <laughs> yes, £2.80. You could put it around the llama. Put all your pins around the llama. Bert to sell out. Oh, I love him. Love his hat. So cute. Okay. Um, what are these? Little frames. Are these little frames and um, envelopes? So if you want to frame one of your cross stitch or embroidery pieces, maybe as a card, new baby or wedding or engagement or a lovely card that somebody could keep. These are great, aren't they? Cards and envelopes. Look at your price, less than a pound. And they're really lovely quality as well, in ivory. Slightly sort of textured as well. They've got that hammer effect. Just 95p. There's loads of treats in the kitchen. There's uh, celebration chocolates. You just want Toblerone. Just want Toblerone. Has anybody ever tried the white Toblerone before? Is it good? I didn't even know that that... I didn't even realise that that was um, a thing, a white Toblerone. That is one thing I didn't get for Christmas this year. Normally it's just given that I'd have a Toblerone in my um, stocking. I'm quite pleased though, because that is something that I can't just eat one little section. I do love Toblerone as well. This must be my 50th mince pie this year. It's gotta be. I've eaten so many mince pies. Hannah had four yesterday. Four mince pies. <laughs> sold out, sold out, sold out. Hannah even thought that was a bit excessive. Oh, they're just so nice, aren't they? Gotta get them all out of the house. Kieran's been having a panic every time we've been to, um, to the supermarket saying, have we got mince pies? Have we still got mince pies? I'm like, yes, there are still mince pies. Should we do some patterns? Let's do some patterns because these have been so, so popular. This is your bag it up. I've got a lunchbox uh, made with Tula. Do you remember the Jerry, uh, Jerry Halliwell song? Bag it up, dum, 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 dum. I can't remember, but I'm sure it was that. 9 99 it's now two pounds. It's a really lovely square bag. I think this is ideal for a lunchbox. Maybe your New Year's resolution is to make your own lunch now to take to work. Healthy start. I want to start making lots of soups to freeze. You make lots of soup, don't you, Paul? You need to send me some recipes. Just two pounds for your bag instructions. It's got the, um, this one's got that Soline foam in it. Is it Soline? Just your foam. So it's a real structured bag and it's got lots of pockets. Nice for a school bag as well, nice for um, somebody um, after school, maybe their packed lunch in there. I've got the unicorn backpack up next, by the way, Becky's one, and that was so popular when we launched it. I haven't even had a look in at that one. Two pounds, everything that you need. Of course, all of your measurements, this is all cut from rectangle, so you don't need any templates with this one. The next one that we've got is the, um, is the unicorn backpack, which as I said, has been so popular. Unicorns are just everywhere. Unicorns are still very, very on trend. I had a unicorn um, little key ring this year. I love unicorns. Who doesn't? Never too old for unicorns. Unicorn backpack with your templates included. So look, you've got all of your to scale templates. All of your instructions from Becky. And those of you that know uh, Baffa and follow Baffa, you know that you get a great extensive instructions. Baffa, I was talking earlier on about some of my highlights of Sewing Quarter and absolutely one of my favourite guests always will be Baffa. She is just 
an absolute pleasure to work with. She's so, so talented. She's such an amazing artist and designer, of course, but she's just so humble and so lovely. She's been one of my favorite guest designers. You can follow her as well on Facebook so you can still get all of your tips and our Baffa fixes. I know she's been doing some great videos, really extensive um, instructional videos, which you'll be able to follow on Facebook as well. So don't worry, I'm sure most of the guest designers that you've, that you've loved watching, you continue to watch either via John Scott's Sewing World or um, on their own Facebook page. We've got another unicorn. Uh, this is a dream believer. Oh, it's Joe Carter's. This is Joe Carter's. Okay, in this you get the big and small instructions for two pounds. Look, there's the larger one. So I'm guessing, oh, your templates are to scale as well. You don't need to scale them up. That's why it's obviously larger. Look, you've got all of your to scale instructions. It's amazing. Your template booklet's there. All of your instructions are the same. It's just your templates. Um, you can make the smaller one or the larger one. How good's that for two pounds? Great value for money, and of course, it's Joe Carter. Um, of course, a lot of people who um, absolutely love Joe Carter and follow Joe Carter do sign up to John Scott Sewing World, as I know Joe's going to be a part of that as well. That's lovely, isn't it? Lovely gift for somebody. I can imagine it in a nice little, um, little fleece. No. No, um, Hannah's going to message you back about you singing eggs. She says, I've saved your message. It. I've saved your um, to do on to do list is to message Mo. What are you going to, what is Mo talking about? The egg, the egg timer, the singing egg timer. Amazing. Okay, we've got a template, sewing cords template. You star. Um, let's skip past it because we might be able to come back to that. I don't know whether we've got it. I've got the festive origami wreath. I've got the Christmas folding wreath. Okay. And I've got the, um, that one's called the hook, isn't it? The hook. Or is it? Yeah, this is the only other one that I've got now, I think. Um, we'll check because a lot of these have been on the website. There's lots that have sold out. Your lovely wreath design. Oh, I saw this in the, um, I swear I saw this in the dressing room earlier in the box. This is really lovely. Nice with your felt. We've got, um, we've got felt coming up actually. So if you want to do um, this out of felt, you could make it in January, then put it up in the loft ready for next year. That's going to be what I, I am going to do this year is to get everything all prepared. Because I always have the intention of being all prepared for Christmas. And then I'm always that last minute Larry running around trying to get wrapping paper and stuff. So this year, I am gonna be able to get my, all of my Christmas cards and decorations and bits and bobs. In a sale, it's great, isn't it? Two pound. Everybody seems to have had babies over the last couple of years in my life. So I had about nine children to buy for. <laughs> I haven't had nine children, Paul. Um, no, I've had about nine children different to buy for this year. So yeah, it does, it does, um, it takes time. I need to get a load of wrapping paper this year. Um, right, we'll come back to those if we can do them. I'll show them to Hannah. Should we do some felt? These are really good to stock up on because the price is crazy. Are you ready? Multi-buy, they'll already come pre-cut, but multi-buy, multi-buy, these are great for your stash or to get children involved in sewing. This is the great thing about sewing culture is that we've encouraged so many newbies to start a new skill, start a new hobby. Still can. We saw the lovely girls earlier on um, who have made those great lined bags. This is your 100% pure wool, so it's really lovely quality. Molly and Daisy have been really, really busy over the last couple of years making, so um, they did lined makeup bags. I mean, it's crazy how good that is. But, I mean, this is 100% pure wool. It's really lovely to sew with. Your sunshine colour. Great for things like the wreath that we were talking about, or great for Christmas decorations, lovely for embellishments. If you like sort of the folky designs, some of Fiona Hesford's 
on bags, and this is really good for applique. We've all learned so much, haven't we? Han, you've got to continue with your EPP. We want to see pictures on your um, Instagram. Can you take it with you to Burma? You're going to take a bit of hand stitching? <gasps> Who's got travel Ted? Tell Laura. Laura's got it. You need to text Laura and tell her to bring it in tomorrow. Laura doesn't like sharing travel Ted. And tra I've got a feeling something might have happened to travel Ted because Laura won't... <laughs> Where's Travel Ted? This is a mix. This is a wall mix. I hope Laura hasn't lost Travel Ted. Um, well, will you text Laura, please, today and tell her to bring Travel Ted in tomorrow so that you can take Travel Ted to Burma? Because then we want to see Travel Ted on um, your Instagram. Just a pound for your thick, 100% pure wool felt. It's that vintage duck egg. It's beautiful, isn't it? If you've got Sue Quinn's books, if you've got, speaking of Travel Ted, if you've got any of Sue Quinn's books, she does lovely little animals with felt. These are 100% pure wool. Really lovely quality. It's not like the craft wool felt that's going to that's gonna fray or tear or rip. Nice to do Louise Kelly's dolls about town. Um, even little coats, jackets, boots. Lovely blue, another blue. Oh, this would be nice for Louise Kelly's Dolls About Town. I can imagine a nice jacket with a bit of rickrack around it. There's another guest designer who I absolutely have adored working with, Louise Kelly. She's just amazing, isn't she? Keep in touch with her. £2.50 down to a pound. 20 by 30 centimetre. Yeah, a pound's amazing. It's pure wool. Normally £2.50, which is great. Today's just a pound. Problem is, lots of these are selling out. Lots of the felts are selling out. It's really nice. Um, that's the last one in blue. We've got pink. Two different pink shades. This looks like pure wool. What was the last thing that you bought for a pound? I was thinking, I think I bought some chocolate money, but I didn't. It was one ninety nine. You know, the chocolate money. Do you know, I bought it from, uh, you know the, the ones that you have in your stocking? No, it's not, is it? But do they do it in that shop that they sell everything for a pound? I got it from, I've got it from, B, I, I got it from B&M Bargains, which is a bargain hunter shop, isn't it? <laughs> it was a big, it was a big amount of money, chocolate money. <laughs> I was a Swiss, they said I was Swiss. Wool felt again for one pound. Well, there you go, wool felt. That's brilliant value. See, if you go to that shop that they sell everything in a pound, you might get felt, but it will be the craft felt that will probably tear. Yeah, in the, in the kids' bit, they might have, um, yeah, the ones that pull apart felt. This is, again, 100% pure wool. This won't pull apart. Pale pink. Hang on, this isn't even a pound. You get a couple of pence back in your pocket. There's our Han. In Annette's um, hat. I love my hat as well, Annette. If you're watching, thank you very, very much for my hat. I could show it to you in the next hour if you'd like. There's Paul. If you want to follow him on Instagram, absolutely follow him. And if you want to follow me, it's two-tone acoustic, two-tone official. Um, two underscore, uh, underscore, I always say underscone. I think I'm thinking about scones. I'm singing. That's me at um, a lovely place. I think it was called, um, I want to say Blackwood, Blackwell Grange. I can't think, I can't think. No, that's just my living room. It's lovely, isn't it? <laughs> uh, two underscore, uh, underscore. <laughs> Two underscore tone underscore acoustic or two tone official on Facebook. That's probably the best way to find where we are if you want to come and see us live in the town near you.
I want to do a sewing quarter tour around the country. Hello, Audrey. I'll miss you so, so, so much. Oh, we'll miss you. We will miss you too. Honestly, it's been a pleasure to, to be. Thank you for, for choosing us to be in your living rooms every morning. About to sell out. That is a big red uh, square, isn't it? 45 centimetre square. <laughs> okay, is that all of the felt that we have? Yep, about to sell out about to sell out. Let's do the other embroidery skeins because all of them were selling out very, very quickly in the last, in the last show. This, this time it's your DMC, isn't it? No, these aren't, these are Anchor. Let's do the silver, your metallic silver. This is your Lame, metallic silver thread. We used it on the unicorn, this one. 80 pence, Hannah. Why are you doing this? It's just so crazy. Unbelievable value, isn't it? Just 80p, it was 99. Eight meters, lovely to add a bit of embellishment, a little bit of sparkle. If you love um, Helen McCook, if you love her style, if you love embellishing with some beautiful sparkly metallic thread, it's great. I am thinking just to personalise things. What about on a denim jacket? Just a trim on a pocket, just on the flap of your denim jacket pocket. ATP, you can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Half the stock has been checked out. We had a nice big stock of this one. If we managed to get the unicorn, this is what we used. Did we use it on the face embellishments? Nice for toy making as well, just to add a little bit of sparkle. Was 1.99. It's now 80p in our warehouse clearance. Uh, right, should we go to the red? Hand sewers, embroidery. Uh, if you love Kara Ackerman, another lovely, lovely designer who we've had the privilege of working with, who has encouraged us to try personalising maybe things you've already had, other makes that you've done. Embellishing fabrics as well. It doesn't need to be a solid plain fabric to embroider on. Ninety nine pence down to forty pence. Hi, Hilary. Oh, Hilary, I was talking about the Millennium earlier on. I was saying it was 20 years ago since Robbie William bought out the song Millennium. And it just feels like 10 years ago, not 20, doesn't it? Hilary, and I say, what did you do on the Millennium? I think Hilary's top trumped us all. Um, it says, sorry, I've got my big um, water. Let me put it down here. I've got it right next to the iPad. It's nice and safe, isn't it? Um, what sold out? Is that the red? The red sold out. Hillary said, my husband and I got married on the Millennium Day. It was the perfect day. Even the weather remained nice with a gorgeous sunset for the photos. That's from Hillary. Hillary, congratulations on 20 years of marriage. That's amazing. Oh, what? Let's see, everybody will, there's no excuse that everybody will always remember your wedding anniversary, won't they? That's so good. And to remember as well exactly what the weather was like. It was a lovely sunny day. I wonder what it's going to be like this year. Christmas Day was beautiful, wasn't it? It's really lovely where, uh, in the Midlands. This one's number ending in, oh, I don't know, actually, I haven't got the number. Because I have got two browns. Three, five, eight. Yes, you're right, three, five, eight. 40 pence, 40 pence. I was really concerned about my friend. I kept um, messaging my friend on Christmas Day and he wasn't replying, my best friend. And he just texted me the next day saying, so sorry, I had a phone-free day. And I thought, what well, a good idea. I would like to do that for a day, actually. I think we all rely on our phone way too much, don't we? Well, I'm Google. I want to do a Google-free day, see all of the six things that I know. <laughs> Maybe seven. 2020, yeah. 2020 um, task is to add a few more things to the 
to the six things I know. Maybe I'll get it up to ten without Google. <laughs> um, all right, then I can go to a pub quiz. One of the things I know is how many minutes are in a year. 525,600 minutes. That's one of my six facts. I don't know how many are in a leap year, no. Oh, do you know, I'm going to go to my first pub quiz and say, I'm ready. All my facts, all ten facts ready to go. And then they're going to say, yeah, they're going to say, how many minutes are in a leap year? Oh, that would be absolute typical. I've still got a few more. I've got 217, a lovely green. 217! Pink. I have never watched it before. Ninety-nine pence down to just forty pence. Did anybody watch Call the Win Midwife on um, Christmas Day? Didn't Gavin and Stacey get something stupid like twelve million viewers? I think everybody was, yeah, apart from Paul. You weren't one of the twelve million, were you? Twenty-six. That's a lovely colour, isn't it? Real hot pink. That's nice for with you unicorns. Li yeah, I think it is. It's called lipstick pink. Eight metres for 40 B. You can't go wrong at that price, can you? Stock up your stash. Do you want a mince pie, Paul? Number six to finish. Number six is that lovely um, light blush pink, which is great for things like embellishing on faces, I think. I'm thinking embellishing on faces, maybe um, little noses on animals. We've had lots of great inspirational books, haven't we? What about for baby girl? Do you know any um, baby girls that are going to be born in 2020? Exciting, you could do some embellishing of their name or the date they were born on a special piece. I loved the, um, the frames that we had earlier. I've not seen those, the frames with envelopes. If you want to make a special keepsake card. 40 pence. It was 99, that's your pale pink, eight metres, stranded cotton. Okay, yeah, this is a good text topic. Um, I was talking about earlier on how on a flight you can get extra leg room by requesting to sit at an exit. Has anybody ever got upgraded on a flight? Just randomly. If you did, how did you get upgraded? Um, I know my um, one of Kieran's family got upgraded because he was travelling alone. So you might just get upgraded. You might get upgraded. Just do you, do you ask for an upgrade? Just, you have to ask. I think you have to ask, don't you? Message in, if you've ever got upgraded, please let us know, because Hannah really wants to get upgraded on the 30th. Do you have to dress, do you have to dress quite smart, do you think? But then you're not comfortable. Maybe dress smart and take a, your pyjamas in a bag or something comfy to, to, to add. <laughs> Our other Madeira Freds. Oh, your rayon ones. You've got a metallic one, and you've got your viscose filament. Um, which one do you want? To... <laughs> Let's go with the metallic first. Hannah's telling us about. I'm not going to repeat it on it. Don't you worry. It's, you might be still having your breakfast. But Hannah's telling us about her previous flight experiences, and I now understand how desperately she wants to get upgraded. One pound forty. Anna has some really bad flying experiences. Follow her on Instagram to find out whether she got upgraded. Does that, what airline are you flying with? Air Turkey, if anybody knows anybody um, that can get her an upgrade. Mm. 
Look at that lovely metallic sheen. You're going to get great for embellishments again. £1.40. Hello, Fiona. I've got Hillary's message still on my screen. Fiona from Kent says, I was upgraded, we were upgraded on a US flight. Didn't ask. <laughs> my daughter bounced on all of the beds on the flight. They were full beds. Ah, oh, amazing. How did you do it, Fiona? How did you get upgraded? Best to dress smart. My cousin works for BA. Okay, dress smart, Hannah. Elaine said upgrades are only if you pay. Ha Hannah doesn't want to pay, Elaine. <laughs> she can't afford to pay. Or if the airline needs your seat, so they move you to another flight and then they say, oh, we will upgrade you. That's what happened to Wayne. Do you remember Wayne? So Wayne, um, he had a, a trip to Thailand. It got delayed so much that they came up to him and said, we're really sorry about your delay. Um, because we're so apologetic, we'll give you and your family another flight to Thailand at, the cho at, your, at your choice of dates. So we had another holiday because they were delayed. So you don't really want to be delayed because you're going on New Year's, you get there New Year's Eve, don't you? Doesn't mind being delayed on the way back, but you could, ask, you could ask how much it is to upgrade and you never know if they have seats, it might be, I don't know. Let's do the green, this is your rayon thread, beautiful color. Any more tips on how to get upgraded? So you've got to dress smart. Right, this is Hannah. <laughs> Let's show you Hannah. This is Hannah on a flight. Are we going to upgrade her? Yes. <laughs> oh dear. You've not been on the, the... I always am very, very lucky that I sit next to people that I've got on so well with on a flight. Kieran puts his headphones on, so I have to make best friends with the person next to me. And I am that person, sorry, that I sit next to and talk to you the whole time. And I've met some lovely, lovely people. In fact, I sat next to a lady once who taught me how to do cross-stitch. It was before I started at Sewing Quarter. Um, Hannah was next to somebody who told uh, about the, his full hip replacement in detail and then made a wave to his wife on the other side of the, um, the plane. <gasps> She's also had a lady faint on her. She was fine, she was fine. Just got over hot, <gasps> bit flustered, sitting next to Hannah, I'm not surprised. And then there was a Spanish lady on the German flight <laughs> that kept what? Kept asking what everything was in German. Didn't understand Hannah saying, I'm not German. So Hannah started making up what they were saying for fun. <gasps> oh my word. <laughs> 7 99 down to £3.20. Tell us your best plain stories. Can you uh, top trump Hannah? She has some pretty good stories. Do you know when you see these YouTube videos where everyone gets up into song and they start all singing together or your air hostess is doing a really good call where they do like a rap or something and it goes viral on YouTube? I've never been on a flight like that. They always just say, oh, you know, the ex is here and here and here. They never do a rap or a cool song. Susan, I don't know if there's a small bit, a uh, first bit to your message. She says, and even we don't get free upgrades. Oh, maybe it's, is it Susan who's, who's Fred works for BA? Was it Susan who's, oh no, that was Elizabeth. Sue, message back. What was your message before that? Because it just says, and even we don't get free upgrades. I feel like there was a good story before that. Um, Hannah's not holding high hopes on her upgrade wishes, but it'd be lovely, wouldn't it? How far, how long's your flight? 24 hours. It would be lovely to have a, one of those lie down beds, wouldn't it? Should we do your John Jane pedal needles? I've got the pebble needles and then I've also got the sharps. Nice in a little um, packet as well, so great for on the move. One ninety nine down to 80 pence. You've got three different flights to take. Gosh, 24 hours. You need to make friends on your flight, because that's a lot of... Oh, 
Um, Hannah's made some lovely friends as well as the um, strange conversations she's had. Oh, she's heard lovely love stories on flights. Do you know, I always say, if you, t Paul, this is a bit of advice to you who wants to go on some more dates. You actually sit longer chatting to somebody on the plane, don't you, than you do on a date. You should just keep going on dates or go on the plane. That's it, yeah. Just get lots of flights. You might find the love of your life sitting next to you on the plane. 72 pence. 72 pence. Uh, we'll do some more needles. We've got the quilting long needle, mid um, quilting needles. Sizes five to ten. Yeah. Ninety-nine pence down to forty pence. Down to just forty p. I flew up to Glasgow a couple of months ago. I didn't realise you're not allowed to paint your nails on a flight. No, I painted my nails. I didn't realise you're not allowed to. Yeah. No. Yeah, got dodd off. I suppose it is a bit of an overwhelming smell for everybody, isn't it, when somebody gets a nail varnish out? Sorry about that, everyone on my flight to Glasgow. It's not good when you're watching a sad film. It's that embarrassing moment of, okay, you're at, my face is wet and somebody's asking me, do you want a glass of water? And you're like, no, can you not see I'm having a moment here? <laughs> but no, I do love watching, um, watching a good film and playing those games that are really annoying that you're like, oh, I've got to keep playing. I once on the way to, um, I once on the way to, I can't remember where I was going. I think it was when we were, I was in ABBA and we had a show in Dubai. It was amazing. We went out there and I decided to host uh, an exercise stretch class at the back of the plane for everybody. I am that person, that annoying person on the plane. Have we got the wrong one? Oh yeah, that's this one, sorry. These are your gold plated needles, um, size 24, £2.50 down to a pound. Good to stock up, isn't it? Jenny, yes, use your advent calendar voucher. Yes, yes, yes. Any terms and conditions, read the back of the, the voucher or, or call the customer service team. They'll be able to help you. But absolutely, use your voucher. We've got the cotton darners. Okay, 60% off. I want to know if anybody's um, broken Hannah's, Hannah's record of having four mince pies in a day. There's a lot of mince pies. Oh, they're still on the same one, yes. 40 pence. Got a message from Hannah. Not Hannah, Hannah. Different Hannah. Hi, team. Hope you all had a lovely Christmas. Hope you had a lovely Christmas too, Hannah. I'm currently on day four of Bubbles and, Bubble and Squeak. I love Bubble. Bubble and squeak diet, all the joys, roll on New Year. I know, I'm like that. I'm like, right, got to eat all this pate and all the different bits and bobs. Oh, I only ever have it at Christmas. I'll never buy pate any other time of the year. But it's lovely, isn't it? Kathleen's also said, tell Paul, try bingo. My friend took her grandson, uh, he, he didn't want to go home, and then he met his wife. She was helping her nana. Oh, I suppose you know that they're a good person if they're there helping their nana at bingo. Go for it. I love bingo as well. I'll come with you, Paul. Right, January, let's all do a sewing quarter trip to bingo. It's such good fun. Do you know who is an avid bingo player? Wayne. He goes every week. Yeah, it's really good fun. Yeah, we can go. When you get back, we'll wait till you get back from Burma. This has been at the front of my desk for the last couple of hours. We've got to do it because this is so much fun, isn't it? I just love it as embellishments. Do you know if you buy like a little gift box? I would, I would put it in a little gift box and, um, you know, as little um, streamers. What project did we use it in? To create fused fabric, lay strands, lay strands of this, between sh two sheets of paper 
iron using a medium setting, excess heat will alter the colour properties uh, too little and it will not bond. Bonding process can be repeated so offcuts can use again. That's cool. I'm just looking at what you can use it with. Can be trapped between layers, added effects, the resulting fabric can be embellished um, for further with a stitch so you can stitch with it as well. Oh, let me know what you're going to use it for because there's loads of you just checked out on that. Well, I missed that show, so I didn't know. But it's obviously um, to create fused fabric, isn't it? Making your own fused fabric. Lovely line. Oh, I want to have a go with this now. The amount of people that just come in and, and, uh, and uh, made the most of the pink then really, really quickly. I want to um, know what it is that you create with this. Send in a picture. Send in a picture. How did your carrot concert go? I love that it's called like a concert now. It wasn't a concert. It was... I did perform, yeah. So I suppose I did make it into a concert and it was really, really good fun, thank you. I am going to make it an annual thing, I think. Um, yeah, you can come next year. It's... Um, I am going to sort of practice my, my carols a bit more though and I really want a jumper that says Mrs Christmas Carol, that was a couple of things I was missing this year, I can perfect it for next year, but actually do you know what, everyone was in fine voice, Hannah where were you during the carols? Hannah was dancing outside, oh yeah, you couldn't get in, it was too busy. <laughs> Hannah watched through the window, we like keep her out, she can't sing. She's going to ruin the videos. 299 down to 120. John was very good though. He was very vocal. He was in fine voice. Yeah. 299 down to £1.20 for that bright lemon. Paul stayed awake. He was really annoying. Paul stayed awake all day until, well, all night until what time, Paul? Five in the morning. Paul, how annoying is that? One pound twenty. Vix, bingo. I can't think of anything more boring. John in Lancashire. Um, John in Lancashire, you obviously haven't come to bingo with us. It's so fun. Did you know that bingo though now, they don't use a dopper, they don't use the bingo doppers, they've got it all on iPads. So it's all just, and you can actually do it on, you can do it on auto things. So when it comes up, it will just automatically do it for you. So you can sit having your glass of wine or eating your fish and chips or whatever. <laughs> I, um, I, I physically like a dopper though. I do like to physically use a dopper as opposed to just letting the technology do it for you. Jan, it's brilliant fun. It's really good fun. We're going to go, but Jan said, count me out. She thinks it's going to be boring. What date are you back, Hannah? February. 30th of Jan. OK, let's get a date in the diary. Maybe Valentine's. For Valentine's, we could do it. OK. Um, I've got a golden leaves wall hanging pattern. Oh, this is lovely, isn't it? Golden brown texture like sun. Three, um, three spools out of five in your di difficulty scale. <laughs> it was 9.99 down to two. <laughs> 12 by 20 and a half inches. You could do those. Hannah's got so many new business ideas. I mean, it's so exciting. You've got to follow her on Instagram to find out which ones, um, <laughs> which one comes the reality because she's got such amazing ideas. I love the one about your Birmingham City Centre project. There's loads. Didn't you want to work on a cruise ship as well? Helen in Devon, 
Thank you so much. She says, um, good morning, Vicky and team. Good morning. Just wanted to say I'm going to miss you so much. You're my favourite presenter. I wish you all the best in the future. Thank you, Helen. Thank you. It's lovely to be here. Honestly, I've learnt so, so much. I've learnt so much. You'll still see me about. You'll still see me about. I'm not going, I'm not going too far. OK. <laughs> Grandma's needle case. This is lovely. Is this a Lynette Anderson? Yeah, you can tell Lynette, Lynette Anderson star straight away, can't you? We actually had Lynette Anderson here. We've called it the sweet, uh, the sweet scissor holder. It's, it's exclusively designed for us. Which is brilliant, isn't it? It's the same one. How much was this? Do you know? How much was this before? This was 10.99. It was 10.99, it's now two pounds. That's more than 60% off, way more than 60% off. Everything is selling out. As soon as you see something you like, please do check out as soon as you can. Virtually everything is now selling out. What's, is this for your um, curtains or blinds or? Eyelet tape, a metre piece of eyelet tape, 80 pence, 80 pence, this is great isn't it? I wonder whether you could use it, um... <laughs> I wonder you know, you could get experimental with it, no it's a bit too far apart, I'm thinking <laughs> There's all so much you could use it for. That's, that'd be really good. Oh, I forgot that it had these sticky outy bits that just poke me in the eye. Good one, Paul. Good idea, Paul. Right, let's do hooks and eyes. Hook and eyes. Dresser makers. 60% off everything. £1.49 down to 60p. What sort of promotions are you going to offer? Just 60p for all of those I can eyes in the packet you've got 14 sets. They're nice and delicate as well, aren't they? They're lovely for dressmakers. Oh, he's not listening to you. 60p! Um, oh, did you manage to get the zips earlier on in the bundle? We did an offer on the early bird that's £30, normally £30 or worth £30 for £5. It was brilliant. You don't have the zip? If, are there any of the early birds left? Have a check on the website. Refresh the web page. I think there's about 25 not checked out. That's it. We started with over 300. Make the most of those whilst you can because the, um, the, the price is brilliant on that. The little curtain hooks, you get 25 in a bag. These are really useful, aren't they? If you make curtains, that's great for 40 pence. Twenty-five of your um, plastic curtain hooks. I mean, they were normally only a pound. It's a great price anyway, but you, you can't resist a forty p. If you've already paid your p and p, add them to your order. Just forty pence. Should we do the cord? This is nice for little drawstrings, little drawstring bags. Or I'm thinking for Christmassy bits and bobs. Christmassy bits. Nineteen P. £4.99 
49 pounds down to 90. Nineteen pence, you can't go wrong. Right, if I multiply this, it'll already become pre-cut, won't it? I'm guessing. Um, as it is one metre long. It's a metre long. Hello, Kathleen. <laughs> if you're going to do bingo, invite lots of single ladies for Paul. Then do a charity game, prize dinner with Paul, um, with Paul. Money, money to a charity. The thing is, um, I've been trying to find single ladies for so long. I have. You've asked me lots of times, do I know any single ladies? I set you on a date about four years ago. I set him on a date. And it didn't work out. <laughs> I've been doing my best to find Paul um, a date. Right, I think bingo is the way forward. Bingo is the way forward. And I can do a prize dinner. I set you up with, yeah. <laughs> um, okay, let's do our EPP. Right, we've got our EPP six point stars. This is the one ending in 41, Hannah. Ha 41. Kathleen, though, that is such a good idea. I think we could do it. Bingo halls are huge, you know. The amount of people that we'd have to invite, we've got to fill a whole bingo hall. <laughs> With single ladies for Paul. Two pounds. Right, you've got one more day of Paul jokes. You've got one more day of um, jokes and one more day of your, uh, of that, <laughs> that Instagram. Find him, love. There's one more day. Today and tomorrow. The last day with Paul Evans tomorrow. Last day to find him, love. We can do it. We can do it. There's love for everybody. Even Paul. We've got a lovely love story coming through as well. £4.99, you six point star. Oh, this one's open, look. Let me show you what you can make with these. Have we got enough of these for me to spend a minute? No. Are they about to go? I'm making a six point star. Hannah's going to continue with her EPP. A passion she learnt here, so good. What else can we do? I mean, you could do even as a... Um, do like a big diamond. You can do tumbling blocks. It's loads. Honestly, these are really good shapes. I know how popular these are. Just to embellish that onto a children's quilt, you can get so creative. It gets so addictive, doesn't it? I love this. As long as they're attached um, by one side like this. Tumbling blocks, six point star. Extra diamonds, you could do that as a border, couldn't you? Right, can I show you the love story? Claire. Claire, thank you so much for your message. Where's Claire? Oh, you're down the road from us. Oh, Claire, follow me on Instagram and you can come and see me sing. I sing a lot in Sully Hall. Um, right, I got chatting with my husband in 2001 at Birmingham Airport. We talked about the airport and planes being the place to find love. He pointed out his friend uh, that stole our table while my friend and I were ordering food. We were then on the same flight, uh, flight to Ibiza, the same coach when we landed, then we dropped off at the same hotel. We chatted on, uh, we chatted on the day two of the holiday uh, and he suspected that he met me before in a tattoo, in a tattooist in Birmingham. Oh my God. And then I remember we had. Gosh, what a small world, eh? And he was queuing for a tattoo while I was queuing for a piercing and we chatted. <laughs> I love this story. We've been together for 18 years and we're married with three big boys. Claire, love that story. I love that you put it in, the, in a heart. I wondered why it was taking so long to put the love story up. Hannah put it in a heart. Claire, thank you so much for your love story. See, Hannah, I think this could be the, the time that you meet your love at Birmingham Airport. 
Just steal somebody's table. Just someone gets up to order food, steal their table if you think they look pretty. Pretty. Okay, we've got a little hex. It's Claire, thank you so much. And as I said, follow me on Insta as I sing a lot in Solihull so you can come and have a chat with me. Tell me more about these lovely love stories. <laughs> I don't want to know more about the tattooist place. Okay, 4 99 down to two pounds. It's weird, isn't it, though, when you meet people like that on holiday? We've had that before. I've had people who I've met on holiday who are all connected. It's such a small world. They always say you're never more than, I think it's six people away from somebody else. You know, the very famous saying, you're only ever six people away from someone else. I think, no, so, someone you know, basically. You don't know what I mean. You know what I mean at home, don't you? I've said it really wrong. I never get my sayings right. Hayley always takes the mick out of me for one I said to her years ago, and she still tells me, um, about throwing, taking caution and throwing it at the wind. I don't even know what the saying is. Throw caution to the wind, that's it. But I said it, I'm going to take the caution, I'm going to throw it at the wind. And Hayley still pulls me up on that. Look at these little dinky hexies, they're so cute. So cute. Okay, they've gone. They have gone. We've got a couple more patterns. Oh, we've got a minute. Should we do um, one pattern? We'll carry on with them in the next hour. This is the Emma Pinafore 01. Meet your spring staple, the Emma Pinafore. This versatile style has a flattering gathered detail and two length, um, two, and two length and pocket options. So you can have it like this length or not like six degrees of separation is what I'm talking about. Thank you for messaging in. 8.99 down to just two pounds, six to 20. Hello, Rebecca. Oh, Baffa. It says Rebecca in Shop Shopshire there, very formal. It's lovely Baffa. Hi, Vixen team. I think you need to set up a dating service for Paul. I know we do, don't we? I love you. She says, miss you lovely people, love Baffa. We're trying, aren't we? Right, here you go. This is Paul. Follow him on Instagram. If you think he's cute, give him a like. If you think you can set him up with somebody, he's, uh, <laughs> he's 37, he's from Birmingham. What's your name and where'd you come from? We can set up a... He doesn't wear that suit every day, but he does look very smart every day. He can wear that suit every day. Oh, Baffa, we love you loads and loads and loads. And I've been encouraging everybody to, to follow you on Facebook for all of your tips. We, um, we love you. Uh, OK, we're going to go to a break, but we're going to be back with more. Anything that we didn't get a chance to do this hour, we will roll into the next hour. Still loads of bargains coming up right after this. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. We're obsessed with designer fabric at Sewing Quarter. From the quirky prints of Tula Pink and K Facet to the more traditional William Morris and Liberty. With our great discounts and capped delivery of just £2.95, who could resist topping up the stash? Check out all the gorgeous fabric we have on offer on our website, www.sewingquarter.com and see our top 10 picks on our Pinterest page. It's easy to buy the products you see on our shows. To buy any of the items featured on today's programmes, just head over to our website, www.sewingquarter.com. Click on the video stream and you'll be taken to our watch page. Here you'll find the product that is on air right now at the top of the page. Beneath that, you'll find all the products demonstrated in this morning's shows. To add an item to your basket, simply log into your account or register with us. Then you can either check out or keep shopping. Remember, our flat rate delivery charge lets you shop all day and check out as many times as you like and only pay once for postage and packing. Only on Sewing Quarter, Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687. 
From gorgeous florals to nursery rhyme themed prints and paisley, our Lessien fabrics are great for all your vintage style makes. And what's more, they're at a discounted price. Visit our website at www.sewingquarter.com to view the full range and discounts. Did you know Sewing Quarter have our very own app? Available to download on all iOS and Android devices. Simply go to the App Store or Google Play and search Sewing Quarter. Once you've downloaded the app, you'll be able to watch Sewing Quarter 24 hours a day and purchase all of the products featured on today's show. So download the app today and keep watching Sewing Quarter on the move. Have you heard about the Sewing Quarter Fans Facebook group? It is a great place to chat to fellow SQ viewers, presenters and guest designers. Share sewing and quilting tips and see what other fans have made. You will even receive exclusive offers and find out about new products and projects before anyone else. Simply search for Sewing Quarter Fans on Facebook to join the group and be part of the SQ community. Follow us on Facebook to see some of our favourite makes that we have coming up, which fabulous guests will be joining us and some of our fantastic offers and discounts. We also hold one-off Facebook Lives with special guests and demonstrations exclusive to Facebook. Just search for Sewing Quarter on Facebook to find us. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. Did you know that you can stay up to date with all of Sewing Quarter's demonstrations with our email newsletter? Our newsletter brings you regular updates on what is coming up on the show, as well as exclusive offers, discounts and events we will be at. Be the first to know what's coming up by signing up for our newsletter. You can do all this by heading to our website and clicking on the Newsletter button. All we need is your email. It's easy to buy the products you see on our shows. To buy any of the items featured on today's programmes, just head over to our website www.sewingquarter.com. Click on the video stream and you'll be taken to our watch page. Here you'll find the product that is on air right now at the top of the page. Beneath that, you'll find all the products demonstrated in this morning's shows. To add an item to your basket, simply log into your account or register with us. Then you can either check out or keep shopping. Remember, our flat rate delivery charge lets you shop all day and check out as many times as you like and only pay once for postage and packing. Only on Sewing Quarter, Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687. Have you heard about the Sewing Quarter Fans Facebook group? It is a great place to chat to fellow SQ viewers, presenters and guest designers. Share sewing and quilting tips and see what other fans have made. You will even receive exclusive offers and find out about new products and projects before anyone else. Simply search for Sewing Quarter Fans on Facebook to join the group and be part of the SQ community. There are many ways you can watch Sewing Quarter. We are live every day on Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687 and online at sewingquarter.com. But if you've missed a show, don't worry. There are two easy ways to catch up. The first is through our website, www.sewingquarter.com, where we repeat that morning's shows throughout the day. On the homepage, you'll see our video stream. Click on the video to hear sound and see a list of the products that we have shown in that day's shows. The second way to catch up is on our YouTube channel. All our shows are kept on YouTube, so if you buy a product and want to see the demonstration again, you can. Go to www.youtube.com forward slash sewing quarter where you'll find all our shows listed by date. Select your preferred date, then you can pause, rewind, play and skip your way to the bits that you want to watch again. Check out the schedule on our website and watch on Freeview Channel 73, Sky Channel 687 or online at www.sewingquarter.com. is 
going too quick. I don't like it. It's going too quick this morning. I thought, oh, we'll have loads to talk about. It'll be really, really lovely. And um, it's just going too quick. We've still got so much to catch up on. So let me know how your Christmas was. What you're up to New Year. Any plans, any resolutions for 2020? Uh, your fav I want to just hear from you. We've had love stories today. We've had plans for Paul. Uh, we're all getting in touch. I've had loads of new followers. I'm so excited to see you all at my shows, at my gigs. We do do lots of, um, we all like to keep in touch different ways on, um, on, on social media. That's the great thing about it, isn't it? So if you want to message me, absolutely. I, I get that straight to my phone on Instagram, two underscore tone underscore acoustic or Facebook. I actually list all of the gigs that I'm doing. Quite a lot there. They are in the Midlands area, but we do travel all over for different weddings and events. So, um, yeah, if you want to follow me and have a look at where I am or say hello, then that's where I'll be. If you want to follow Hannah on her trip to Burma, it's Patterns and Place. So you can follow her on Instagram. There's a, lo a link to a normal Instagram on there as well. That's um, mainly of her, of her out on the town. But this one will be a bit more arty. Look at those pictures already. They're lovely photographs. This is going to be the, uh, the PG version that's on her holidays. If you want to watch what goes on actually in Burma with Hannah, then you can follow her normal Instagram. <laughs> um, this is Paul, our director. She, he's, a he's a TV director. He is also um, a, a Birmingham-based chap. He's 37 and he's looking for love. I'm sure we can, in the next two days, we can hook you up. We, we've, if, if in doubt, we're taking him, we're taking him to bingo as we think that's probably going to be the best place, or Birmingham Airport. We think either Bingo or Birmingham Airport is your suggestion so far. Maybe you need to, yeah, work at the, as a bingo caller. Oh, my word, that'd be such a good job. I'd love to be a bingo caller. OK. Um, we've got loads to bring you this hour. And, of course, you know the prices are amazing. But we want to make today's show as interactive as possible. I, I did, I don't like goodbyes, but I did say to Hayley, please, can I do a show but in this weird stage between Christmas and New Year as um, our last day is on the 30th. Uh, they are the days that sort of nobody knows what to do. It's a Saturday, but we don't know what to do. Down to 4 99 the little black dress. Derek, you're not the only person that has said that. <laughs> It'd be so much easier, wouldn't it? It would. $14.99, down to $4.99. It's such a lovely book as well. We all love the, uh, the um, LBD, your little black dress. And it actually looks at some of the most iconic dresses and recreates them. So let me skip forward a bit. Lots of great uh, dressmaking tips. Lots of lovely quotes in there as well. Look, some of the iconic red carpet dresses how to recreate those looks, the Audrey. The Greta. I think there's a Marilyn in here as well. There it is. The Marilyn. Your little black jacket. Oh, right. So, our mysterious Tom has also, um, our cameraman, has also uh, wanted to send us in uh, how to keep in touch with him. He felt left out. If you want any photography, we can do you a package deal of your photographer and your music. There you go, your wedding, your weddings and events sorted. We can do you a sewing quarter package. Me and Tom coming along, and, um, and we'll bring John Scott as the, um, he could be your master of ceremonies, couldn't he? Yeah. Do you know what? I could rope John Scott into it. They're saying, we can't promise John Scott, we can't promise John Scott. I've known John for 10 years now. I can, um, we can do our best to put together a package for you. I'm sure he'd love it. Well, Paul could be there. Cool. Paul could be a guest. He drinks a lot of your alcohol and he will um, dance the night away. He'll stay up till 5am. He'll eat all your food as well, but he'll be a great guest. Hannah, what can you be in our wedding package that we'll offer? What could she... Well, judging by your Instagram, you could, again, team up with Tom and be, um, you know, his secretary of um, 
secretary or his second photographer. I don't know what they call it, I'm not very good. <laughs> okay, 25 quick and easy projects to make. Simple applique techniques. Oh, and well, it's signed. Oh, I don't know whether yours is signed. I can't guarantee it will be signed. It might be, little bonus if it is. Uh, down to just five pounds. Come on then, Paul. Do you want to um, get the calculator out? Price per project, we've got 25 projects in here at five pounds. Tablet case, quilted tablet case. Your coffee cozy, 25 projects. 20p a project. Only eight of these books left. Just five pounds, down to 14.99. I do think we need to do a trip up to the Highlands. I wonder if we could wrap it all into one. We can go and play bingo up in the Highlands. <laughs> yeah. I think we should all have a little weekend away. Doorstop or bottle bag. Cushions, nice springtime cushions, peg bag. Does anybody else have a bit of a thing about having the same colour pegs? I've, I've got a bit of a thing about having to use the same colour pegs on the washing line. I can't bear to see something if there's an odd peg. I'd not hang it up if I have two odd pegs at the end. I'm, I've heard other people have got that as well. Um, should we do the other book, the Zaka Home book, 19 beautiful modern stylish designs for your home? This is a lovely book. Feels very, very plush indeed. What have we got in here? All your templates, of course, included as well. There's your projects. Little tea towels, caddies, wall hangings, pin cushions, bags, key rings. I love this one. I think we've done that one before. Almost like your Dresden plate mat. All of your embroidery stitches and techniques are in there. Your armchair caddy, doing a bit of hand sewing, very useful because how many people maybe put their um, pins in the arm of their sofa? <gasps> That's ha handy for that. Also, a wagon wheel of buttons. Oh, the buttons, the TV controller. I love wagon wheels. Do you call it the buttons, your, your remote control? People, let me know what you call it, because I've heard somebody call it the zapper. We've had loads of ask. I'm getting them all in today. You call it the bodger. Oh, I've never heard of the bodger. The bodger, the zapper, the remote control, Hannah calls it the buttons. Uh, Lynn in Cornwall said, come and see us in Cornwall. Oh yes, definitely. Come and see us when you're in Cornwall. I really want to come to see your garden in the flesh, but it's beautiful. Bring Paul, we'll find him a beach babe. Lynn from By the Sea in Cornwall. I will miss your messages, Lynn. Thank you very, very much. Um, you're in Goran Haven. Definitely got to come and visit you. Keep in touch, we'll keep in touch. Sashko, a little bit of Sashko in there. Lynn, I am still going to try and do my um, fitness, uh, fabric fitness DVD. I'm going to pitch it to John and hopefully bring it onto Sewing World. <laughs> onto John Scott's Sewing World. What do you mean it's not going to happen? There's so much you could do. We could do like pull-ups with your sewing machine, your overlocker. Oh no, Lynn's really up for it, aren't you, Lynn? Tooth and nail. This is Victoria Findlay Wolf. Was nine, it was 10.99 down to two pounds. It's a big quilt as well. That's an 80 inch by 64 inch, uh, inch quilt. Hi, Anne, Anne in Sun at Somerset. Thank you so much. She says, I'm so sorry to see you go. You've all worked so hard and built something great. I know, it's a real shame. Um, there'll be a real gap when you finish. Thank you. I know, Anna, I know. But as I say, follow us all. We'll all meet again. I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sure I'm confident in that. Like you say, we've built such a lovely family here that um, 
I'm still hopeful, you know, it won't be the, the end of all of us together. We'll all meet again. 10.99 down to just two pounds for your tooth and nail quilt pattern. In the meantime, it means that you, it's, a, it's a silver lining. You can get some real bargains on all these. This is going to keep you, um, this will keep you up on your makes for, for ages. Oh, this, um, this was actually designed for the um, Harry and Meghan Markle's wedding, but I also think it was kind of designed for mine and Kieran's wedding. So they made, um, I had beautiful selection of things made for my wedding, which I will keep forever. I had the card, the pin cushion, I've got the bunting, the little um, confe confetti. Uh, I actually need this pattern because I had the things made for me for my wedding, but um, I haven't actually got the pattern to do the same for my friend Lauren, who's just got engaged. This would be lovely. Such lovely keepsakes, your pin cushion. And they're really achievable projects. Nice to be able to do the card. Hannah, the H stands for Hannah. I wonder who the M will be. Who's going to be your mister? Could be Mike. Could be Michael. Malcolm. Oh, look, you, you've even got the table places. I didn't know that we had those in there. Throw me your confetti, your celebration. It's Harry and Meghan. Harry and Meghan. It could be Hannah McCabe. Hannah and McCabe. And then there you go, you've got all of your uh, big letters. <laughs> ready for your bunting you sprinkle me for your confetti bags your confetti bag with your drawstrings all of your templates are in there as well for just two pounds that is a lot of projects for two pounds isn't it bunting ring cushion you throw me, sprinkle me and celebrate bags, your little card and your table places as well. Table numbers. That's really good. Um, another big quilt, the Grand Orangery quilt. This is one by Sally Abbott. Another big, 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 big quilt. Nice pinwheels. I like this. From 9.99, this would be great with Liberty or I'm thinking with William Morris. That would look amazing. You could be anything you want to be. You could be anything you want to be, Paul. What did you always want to be when you were young? You wanted to be a milkman. You could still be a milkman. You could still be a milkman. Um, so, the, uh, I know, I don't know if you've met my, uh, my friend Terry. He's a family friend of mine and he has started out, it's like a milkman float, but it's delivering coffee to everyone, like a proper coffee machine take, and takes it all around London to different places. But yeah, no milkman's still um, a thing. Do you still have a milkman? That's a good way of, I suppose that would be a good way of you meeting a, a young lady as well, maybe. You know the saying. 9.99 down to just two pounds. Um, yeah. <laughs> we have a milkman here at its own quarter, don't we? Hello, Gillian. I haven't got Gillian's message, no. Fix, always love your enthusiasm, thank you. Wishing you, Hannah and Paul, a, a fantastic 2020. Hope all of your dreams come true. Thank you, big kiss. Big kiss right back at you. Thank you very much for your message. Oh, we hope Paul's dreams come true too. I think it could be the year for you, um, Paul. Uh, Alison has said, right, Paul. You listening, Paul? I have a single daughter. She's um, from Cornwall. Um, oh, in fact, no. Oh, she's in Moorlands, in, um, in, Staff in Staffordshire, Moorlands. Staffordshire? That's not far, is it? We're like, on the border of Staffordshire. Um, she's looking for someone who would tolerate her sewing stash. Paul? Alison? Alison? Yeah, hook her up. Put her on Instagram. Uh, Paul's Instagram is, there you go, they, the underscore Duke, one, 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 one. 
if you want to um, hook them up, Alison, we'd love that. Got another big star quilt, another Victoria Finlay wolf. It's a 40 by 40 inch. I say it like we've had, another, uh, we've had loads of big star quilts. We've had zero big star quilts. <laughs> oh, you know, all these big, <laughs> these big, <laughs> big star quilts. Oh, I love this, Caroline. Caroline says, oh, oh, no, no, no. Hang on, right. So, Horrid Thought, will the Sewing Quarter fan page be closing too? There'll be still lots of ways of getting in contact. I'm not completely sure, but keep your eyes peeled on um, the fan page and keep your eyes peeled on other pages because I'm not sure, but please, yeah, bear, just, just keep your eyes peeled. We'll all stay in touch, put it that way. Um, as there's lots of tips and inspiration. I know it's such a great community on there, isn't it? Love to all. And Paul, you ready? A big smacker to Paul. <laughs> a big kiss to Paul from Carolyn. Carolyn's in Worcestershire. That's not too far. Do you know anybody, Carolyn? Caroline, sorry. Julie. We call our remote the Huffa Duffer. That's definitely a new one, isn't it? Love to all. So much everyone has different names for their remote control, don't they? I just call it a remote control. Tom, what do you call it? TV remote. TV remote. Yeah, nice and simple. It is, it is what it is. Okay, but we're, we're not creative, apparently. Han calls it the buttons, the bodger, the huffer duffer. I like that one. I might start calling it the huffer duffer. I've got a Drunkard's Path, Victoria Carrington. Um, oh, this is nice. Is this using the ruler? If you've got the three inch Drunkard's Path strip ruler, then this is to use in conjunction with that. Two pounds. I love you, Victoria Carrington. She's another one who we keep in contact with, of course. She does some great videos on her Facebook page. If you search her Victoria Carrington, then you'd be able to find her online. She would have been lovely for you, Paul. I think she's found love now. Oh, <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying. 9.99 down to just two pounds. All of your cutting instructions are on there as well. Okay. I don't know whether you've got these templates, have you? Um, they're like the dragonfly ones. Not sure I've got those. Okay, should we do some buttons? I love these. These are really fancy buttons, aren't they? Lovely, sparkly. Um... <laughs> oh no, we're not selling the remote control, not the buttons. <laughs> See, this must get confusing for you, Han, when you're like, oh, can't find the buttons, and then somebody brings you a tub of buttons. Pound, one pound only, and they're lovely, aren't they? Hello, Diane. The duff. What's with this huffer duffer and the duff? What's the duff and the huffer duffer? Diane calls it the duff. <laughs> Lisa, I like yours as well. <laughs> That's good. No, but what? <laughs> <laughs> what are you on about? Hang on, the duffer. No. The duff. No, don't Google duff. What does it come up? It's a, an Astra a noun, an Australian. Oh, it's a large party or festival with dancing and electronic music in Australia called the duff. We call it, we, that's something totally different um, here, isn't it, if you're up the duff. <laughs> anyway. I didn't realise there were so many different words for the remote control. ATP. Loads of buttons to keep you going. And they're great neutral colours as well, aren't they? Whether they're for small makes or dress making, they're lovely. Okay, so Hannah has gone from Googling every type of singing egg to different words for remote control and duff. Duff. Why is it a huffer duffer? Why have you called it a... 
I really am intrigued to know where that has come from. If there's people all over the country also agreeing that's what they call. Amanda, the pointer of power. <laughs> that's a good one, isn't it? The point of power, that is really good. You got loads of buttons in there. I was gonna um, see if it said how, let me see if it says how many. I don't think it says how many on here, but there's loads in there. There's gotta be probably at least 50, 60 buttons in there. 60 grams of buttons for 80 pence. Oh my word, no, but it's a remote control. Uh, fabric marker, we all like different sorts of uh, uh, fabric marking tools. This one's great. Uh, it's always good to just have a bit of a test, have a bit of a, a check that you're happy with how it removes. To remove this, you would uh, remove it with a, a damp cloth or rinse in cold water. Suitable for your quilting fabrics or embroidery, stitching, on fabrics just to give it a mark if you want to to um, have a temporary marker. One pound twenty. <laughs> oh my word, we've lost the plot. We've lost the plot. I don't know whether Hannah ever had it, but she's she's officially lost it now. She's doing the um EastEnders theme tune, but replacing most of the the do 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 with the the doofs, the doof doofs. I know what you mean. The end of it, the end of a, the episode. <laughs> um, oh, this is way shaper. This is great, obviously for way shaper, but also for straps. I know that um, for straps in your bags, this is great as well. I tell you what, this is what I need in the new year: waist shaper. Two pounds twenty. Nobody's um, come in to say that they've topped you with four mince pies, more than more four mince pies a day. The world record. You could get yourself, Hannah. You could get yourself a Guinness World Record. The Guinness World Record for the amount of eat, uh, mince pies eaten in one minute is two. I could beat that. Let, I want a new Guinness World Record. How many have we got left there? Shall I do a Guinness World Record on my last day ever at Sewing Quarter? Oh, I'm going to do it. <laughs> I could have done a whole a new. I think I've eaten the last one, to be, to be fair. Um, dress patterns, let's do. This was one that Laura and Rhea modelled, didn't they? Remember, we had this one and Laura and Rhea modelled it. No, it was um, Andy. It was Andy... Um, Directing. Two pounds. Well, it's 8 99 down to just two pounds. Size six to 14. Well, it's 8 99 down to just two pounds. Uh, we did a version that didn't have the little gap there, didn't we? Nice little midi style dress. Your sizes and all of the fabric requirements are on the back of the packet, but it's all about price today. It's just two pounds. Stock up whilst you can. All of these patterns are crazy price, aren't they? We've got another one. Oh, I like this with the flare dance. Who was it that demoed this? I'm trying to remember. I feel like I was here when this was on because I love those almost like bell bottom sleeves. These are really nice and flattering, aren't they? different lengths as well. In fact, there's three different variations on this. And I like that you could have a different color. There's plenty of seams here. So you could even do like an illusion. I'll show you on the back. So you could do a different, pa a different fabric on either side and it would give a really lovely illusion, the waist. <laughs> Honey, after all the mince pies I've eaten this year, I definitely need an illusion dress. Uh, just, just an illusion of a, of a, of a waist. Okay. 
Um, this one's the same again, but in that one's size is... What size did you just put in? Because this is the other size. This is the other one, which is the other side, basically. This is 18 to 24. The other one was a smaller variation. Two pounds. All of your size requirements and measurements are on the back. You'll only pay one p and p all day long. The other one was eight, eight to sixteen. This is eighteen to twenty-four. <laughs> A couple of other dress. Oh, we've got some bags. Has it gone cold in here, Tom, or is it me? Is it me? You're all right. You're poorly, though, aren't you? No, you're all right now. Had a bit of a cough. Just got a bit of a cough since so I haven't slept for a month. Is the aircon on? <laughs> this is lovely. Beach bag. Oh, Hannah, is it going to be hot in Burma? Are you going to need a beach bag? 26 to 30 something, that's hot, yes. Seven ninety nine down to £2 for your beach bag. That's a lovely one, isn't it? You could do practice your quilting on it as well, can't you? I do like quilted beach bags like this. Nice summery colours with your tassels as well. Pack your holiday essentials in the beach bag, a jumbo, a jumbo tote, quilted details, on-trend tassels. Here's to golden sands, sunny skies and colourful me makes. Inside, remember you do get your instructions and you'll also get your pattern sheet in there. Just need to obviously add what fabrics you want. Okay, very easy Vogue. Oh, I love these capes. This is so on trend right now, especially these really long capes. I've seen them all over the red carpet. I love that. With a nice boiled wool, that would look beautiful. It's two pounds. And if you're starting out dressing making and you're thinking, oh, do you know what? I find it difficult trying to get something to fit perfectly, to have different darts and all sorts. This is something that's really, really nice and easy. All of the amount of, uh, of course, your fabric requirements are on the back. This is extra small, small and medium sizes. So it's normally about up to size 14. It says, the, the guide price on this is $25. $25. I mean, look at where we are. Two pounds for the three different options of capes can't go wrong you can't go wrong and you could do some lovely buttons like the buttons that we had on these can't you nice big buttons <laughs> the autumn dress easy fit lovely cuffed sleeves button tabs and two curved hem options that looks really nice, doesn't it, with that curved hem? I think you can see there a bit clearer. The pattern includes in sizes 6 to 24. Great size range on this one. I think it would suit everybody, don't you? Oh, absolutely would. Hannah likes her hair. Anna just says, oh, I like her hair. She has got very uh, voluminous hair, hasn't she? Mine needs to be um, a bit more volumised. No, but she's got a really big blow dry, isn't she? She's got a lovely big blow dry. Your hair, nobody can compete with your hair, Hannah. Lola dress. The Lola dress. Oh, you had lovely hair, Paul. 
Didn't you? Back in the day. He had a good head of hair in the 90s. I think it suits you. I think it suits you um, shaved anyway. I think it really suits you. Some people um, are not as fortunate as you to have a lovely shaped head. The Lola dress. Oh, this is nice off the shoulder as well, isn't it? A sleeved option, which is always nice. Two styles to, to, to sew from the spaghetti straps or the off-the-shoulder sleeve. And the bodice is fairly fitted. I don't know if you can see, it's actually more of a, a sort of fitted bodice, so it has got that bodice there. I do love these dresses. I think they're really nice with the um, off-the-shoulder. Maxi length, I suppose, though, you could do it shorter if you wanted, couldn't you? Maxi dresses are my absolute go-to on any holiday. Love it. You don't need to worry about packing a top to go with your skirt or your shorts, do you? Absolutely. High five to that, Paul. A year to remember? Oh, 2019, year to remember. Nine pounds. 22 pounds 50. Down to nine pounds. We'll work together again, Hannah. January, February, what have they got on there for each month? From the Cross Stitch Guild. You can follow the Cross Stitch Guild and go on their lovely um, workshops as well. You can follow them on their, um, on their website. We love Jane Greenoff. She's the founder of the Cross Stitch Guild. Hi, Audrey. Audrey's messaging about the TV controller, the remote control, the zapper, the buttons, the hobber dobber. Duff, duff, duff. The end of East Enders. That's what Hannah was singing. You think that's where it's come from, the duff, duff, duffer? No, but what about the huffer duffer? No, it can't be. Reva's messaging. Reva's messaging a dispute for it, the huffer duffer. What has she said, sorry? The Huffer Duffer was the name that was used for the remote controller on Noel Edmonds TV Addicts Quiz Show. There you go. Found the answer. I was wondering why, because sometimes it's a regional thing, isn't it? What people call it, you know, like a BAP or a batch or a roll or a cob. Don't start that one. But um, it's not a regional thing. It must be from, um, yeah, from, uh, from Noel Edmonds. Julia, Julia. Um, did you do the world record though? That you can beat a Guinness World Record if you eat two, more than two in a minute. Uh, Julia said, mince pies, I ate six in my sleep one night. Are you a sleep eater? Didn't realise till I went home the next day and the box was empty. Do you know, I've watched programmes about that, that people eat in their sleep. Um, that tends to happen to me sometimes when I'm like, uh, no, I think I must have ate it in my sleep because I have no idea. Don't remember it going. All the pizzas Paul eats. But no, it's an actual thing sometimes that people do eat, eat, sleep, eat in their sleep. Um, Ruth. Hi, Vic. I call the remote the Flick It. <laughs> Good luck to you and all the team for 2020. I don't know why I found that funny. That's just tickled me. Because it's tickled me. <laughs> Ruth. The flick it. I think my favourite is the the controller of what was it? The power controller or something? The power? No, not the power stick. The um, the pointer of power. That was good. Right, let's do some of the fabrics. Um, we've got we've got this one available. Some of these aren't. I think some of these have sold out. Um, this is really lovely fabric for curtains. Really nice. It's it's really quite um, heavy duty. Blinds, maybe. Maybe you're doing a bit of a, a revamp in the new year, a refresh. Lovely baby blue. It's only five metres, though, so if you do want to make a bigger project. Mm -hmm. 9 99 down to just four pounds. How good's that? Four pounds. Really lovely heavyweight. Oh, my word. Right, I think we should all enter to go on some game shows. 
Tipping points, the one Hannah's tried to get on. She says, I've tried to do that before. I'm glad the deal or no deal has gone because that was an easy one. I just don't want one that you have to answer questions because as I've told you, I only know the answer to six. Oh, yes, we're replying Paul on first date. I will do that. Now I have a bit more time, I'll be able to do that. I will. I will do it for you. We can get you on first dates. What, are the, what about take me out? Would you go and take me out? Would you go and take me out? Would you go and take me out with Panny McGuinness? £8.49 down to £3.40. <laughs> Your peonies on green. No, that programme shouldn't be on telly, really, should it? £8.49. You know that weird dating one? We're not entering Paul into that. You might, you might see him imagine, you just see his face, you think, I recognise that, where do I know him from? But you don't see his face first. <laughs> I will recognise those feet. <laughs> That's producer Paul. <laughs> oh, I'm going to apply you for that, just, just for the giggles. You get on, you know. <laughs> Paul's would, Paul's would <laughs> oh dear yours will be revealed before everybody else's though wouldn't they three pounds forty it was eight forty nine now just three pounds forty Fee peonies on blue I think that would be a beautiful beautiful central, central block look at the detail it's like a digital print isn't it Well, can't you get all your packing done today, Hannah? Hannah's stressing about getting all of her packing done. She's got to dye her hair. She's got to go for a drink. <laughs> She's got to go for a drink. She's got to do her packing. She's got to go and buy some walking boots, size four, if anybody has any. £4.99 down to £2.5 a half metre. It's your Macawa in olive. It's that lovely linen texture. Linen texture in Macawa, from Macawa. Carol! Carol, happy birthday. Happy birthday. A massive happy birthday. She's 60 today. <gasps> Woo, woo, woo. Um, sewing quarters taught me loads. Never too old to learn. Miss you all. Oh, we'll miss you too. Happy birthday. Have a lovely, lovely birthday. What's it like having your birthday in this strange bit between? But I suppose it's good because everybody's around, aren't they? Everyone's still all off work. Um, hope you've had a lovely, lovely day or hope you have a lovely day today. Okay. You'll always remember my birthday, Paul, won't you? And Lawrence, we're all the same. Well, we're all a day apart. Okay, your peach fruit trees were six forty nine down to just two pounds sixty. Hi Dawn, Dawn's messaging as well. We're having loads of lovely messages. Hello, lovely Mrs. Carol. Ooh. Thanks for everything. We'll miss you. Happy New Year to you and Kieran. You've even spelled his name right, Dawn. Thank you. <laughs> I just thought, no, no one could, I can't even spell his name. Thank you so much. Good luck to you both for 2020. Thank you from Dawn in Greater London. And that's lovely, really lovely message. I don't want to get emotional. I don't like, I'm really not good with goodbyes. I'm just going to be leaving this door straight away as soon as one o'clock goes, because I can't say goodbye to any of you. Yeah, just so you know, I'm just saying to all of you guys, I'm going. I can't say goodbye to anybody. Sars Paul. <laughs> Honestly, it's my favourite team I've ever worked with here. It's everybody. I'm only saying because they're, they're, they're here and they can hear me. No, it is, of course, it is the nicest team I've ever worked with. This is beautiful fabric for curtains. I'd love some curtains out of this. Eight ninety nine 
to three pounds 60 a half meter let me show you how wide it is it's one and a half meters that's it that's great for blinds isn't it very contemporary <laughs> £3.62. We've got two more fabrics. Today's gone really quick, hasn't it? £3 for your seeds. Oh, I love those. That's really cute, isn't it? Again, nice for um, soft furnishings, nice for cushion covers, I'm thinking. Or, or um, Do you know, like, didn't you, didn't you go through a stage of making lots of plant pot holders, Hannah? No? I thought you did. Or do you just have lots of plant tubs? Tubs that you put plants in? I knew I associated plant pot holders with you. I also associated... Hannah with milking cows in Edinburgh. She's never done it, but I must have had a very, very vivid dream years ago and told Hannah. She was like, no, not me. I'm like, no, you, you definitely did. You've definitely told me this before. She hasn't, but I think you could. You could, Hannah. You could do anything. I can still even see it in my head, my dream that I had. That was probably the most vivid dream I've ever had. <laughs> Have you got enough? You've got a big garden, haven't you, Paul? Massive, he says. Massive garden. See, you should put that on your um, dating profile as well. Big garden, loves gardening. He's going to be doing his own little... Um, you're going to be doing your own little veg patch. Herbs. See, you'd be such a great husband. All fresh produce. Green fingers over there. Was 7.49 down to three pounds a half meter. It's quilting weight that break this time. <laughs> 7.49 down to three pounds a half meter. This is just half of the half meter that I'm showing you. That's what half a meter looks like. That'd be great size, isn't it? Just three pounds for your rose stone flowers fabric from the land art range. Was well, seven forty nine down to just three pounds. Sold out, sold out, sold out. I've read your message. Who's that from? Claire. Claire and Solly Hall with the lovely love story. Claire, that's really funny. That's really good. Has she got a name for our uh, remote control? She calls it the Duda. <laughs> I won't go into details of why you call it the Duda. Okay, right, we've got all of these Gutemans separately now. Let's go. Whee! Bingo! First one, first one, there you go. 291, your Guterman, 100 metre polyester. Great for your everyday sewing in your machine. If you've bought any of our kits before, then you will have always had this. Um, would have always, always have had um, this thread. More of you got it in your basket than we have available? They're all gonna sell out. Should we do 203? I'm gonna do the purples first. Yep, yeah. 203 and 58, yep. Yeah. That's a lovely lilac. I'll show you next to the other one that we've just seen, so it's darker shade to that one. It's to 72 pence for 100 metres. pound eighty. Down to just 72 pence. 
203, Hannah. Gosh, I used to do all the dance routines to those songs in the, um, no, in my bedroom on my own. Hannah used to do them. Um, Hannah used to be the background dancer in the girls' groups at school, or in the, with her neighbours. Seventy-two p. It was one eighty down to seventy-two p. That's a lovely deep purple, isn't it? It looks more blue on my screen. If I put it next to a blue, then you can see it's more purpley. You're going to sell out. More have you got in your basket than we have available? Should we do our blue shades? You pick which number is easiest for you. Yeah. We've got lots of lovely blues in here, in fact. Guterman, sew all threads. These are great for your, the, the top of your machine and also your bobbin. Skipping, that used to be a craze, didn't it? When you've got the big skipping rope. I wish I, um, I took that more seriously. I went to watch Cirque du Soleil when I was in Mexico and there were really good skippers in there, like jumping in and doing all sorts. I thought, why didn't I try that? That could have been me. That could have been me. I was quite good at it, if I remember rightly. Is it Elizabeth in Devon has said her remote, called, her remote control is called a clickety-click. Where's the clickety click? <laughs> we will miss you. <laughs> Elizabeth, clickety click. <laughs> 72. <laughs> 72 pence. Oh, dearie me, we have too much fun here. <laughs> 72 pence for your lovely aqua blue. <laughs> That's what I was just thinking. It's like blankety blank, isn't it, the tune? Clickety click. Clickety click, clickety click. Um, 196, Hannah. Slightly different shade again. That was one we've just seen. This is more of a cornflower blue. We've had some real, well, diverse names for the remote control. You used to call it the badger, the bodger. Why? Is that what you've always called it? Yeah. The box is another one that I know a lot of people call it. The box. No, I swear my, my friends at school, they all called it the box. Because I was picking up the box. That one's gone. 311. 311 is your lovely blue, deeper blue. 100 metres of your Guterman polyester sew or thread. Stock up your stash. Just 72 pence. It's all right. About to sell out. It was £1.80. It's now just 75 pence. We've got the 310, your deep navy blue. Oh, I love this. The great thing is, though, it's good to be able to have all these different shades to be able to match in the, the correct colour. I'm just thinking, um, I was just looking to see if we had any. Yeah, no, sorry, 310. It was probably me. You're here tomorrow, Hannah, aren't you? Hannah, Tom, Paul and Lucy are all here tomorrow. It's just me. John, of course, John's here tomorrow. Don't. We've got one more. One more hour. I know you guys are here from the start, weren't you? Literally, very first day. I remember we were all watching your very first launch show. Everyone was on the edge of their seats. About to sell out. The other bluey shade, I'm going to call it bluey because it's more of your turquoise, um, is at 189, Hannah.
72p. 100 metres of that lovely teal, I'm going to call it. Seventy-two pence for your lovely teal, aqua turquoisey sort of colour. It's beautiful. Gone, 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 gone. Right, I'm going to do all the others after the break. Don't worry, we've still got one hour. My last live hour with you. Do, 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 do. No, please get in all your messages. Love to love to hear from you, and I will see you in just a couple of minutes where we're going to do more amazing clearance. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. We're obsessed with designer fabric at Sewing Quarter. From the quirky prints of Tula Pink and K Facet to the more traditional William Morris and Liberty. With our great discounts and capped delivery of just £2.95, who could resist topping up the stash? Check out all the gorgeous fabric we have on offer on our website www.sewingquarter.com and see our top 10 picks on our Pinterest page. It's easy to buy the products you see on our shows. To buy any of the items featured on today's programmes, just head over to our website www.sewingquarter.com. Click on the video stream and you'll be taken to our watch page. Here you'll find the product that is on air right now at the top of the page. Beneath that, you'll find all the products demonstrated in this morning's shows. To add an item to your basket, simply log into your account or register with us. Then you can either check out or keep shopping. Remember, our flat rate delivery charge lets you shop all day and check out as many times as you like and only pay once for postage and packing. Only on Sewing Quarter, Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687. From gorgeous florals to nursery rhyme themed prints and paisley, our Lessien fabrics are great for all your vintage style makes. And what's more, they're at a discounted price. Visit our website at www.sewingquarter.com to view the full range and discounts. Did you know Sewing Quarter have our very own app? Available to download on all iOS and Android devices. Simply go to the App Store or Google Play and search Sewing Quarter. Once you've downloaded the app, you'll be able to watch Sewing Quarter 24 hours a day and purchase all of the products featured on today's show. So download the app today and keep watching Sewing Quarter on the move. Have you heard about the Sewing Quarter Fans Facebook group? It is a great place to chat to fellow SQ viewers, presenters and guest designers. Share sewing and quilting tips and see what other fans have made. You will even receive exclusive offers and find out about new products and projects before anyone else. Simply search for Sewing Quarter Fans on Facebook to join the group and be part of the SQ community. Follow us on Facebook to see some of our favourite makes that we have coming up, which fabulous guests will be joining us and some of our fantastic offers and discounts. We also hold one-off Facebook Lives with special guests and demonstrations exclusive to Facebook. Just search for Sewing Quarter on Facebook to find us. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. Did you know that you can stay up to date with all of Sewing Quarter's demonstrations with our email newsletter? Our newsletter brings you regular updates on what is coming up on the show, as well as exclusive offers, discounts and events we will be at. Be the first to know what's coming up by signing up for our newsletter. You can do all this by heading to our website and clicking on the newsletter button. All we need is your email. It's easy to buy the products you see on our shows. 
To buy any of the items featured on today's programmes, just head over to our website www.sewingquarter.com. Click on the video stream and you'll be taken to our watch page. Here you'll find the product that is on air right now at the top of the page. Beneath that, you'll find all the products demonstrated in this morning's shows. To add an item to your basket, simply log into your account or register with us. Then you can either check out or keep shopping. Remember, our flat rate delivery charge lets you shop all day and check out as many times as you like and only pay once for postage and packing. Only on Sewing Quarter, Freeview Channel 73 and Sky Channel 687. Don't forget, shopping with us is easy and simple. You can just contact us at 0800 112 4433 and speak to our UK-based call centre to place an order. Or shop online with us at www.sewingquarter.com. Welcome back to Sewing Quarter, welcome back. I've got one last hour with you, so um, let's make it good, let's make it good. I really want you to stay in touch with me as well. I am, um, you will see me on, hopefully about, um, but if you want to see me in a city near you, uh, I have forced it upon everybody to, to listen to, well, I say to listen to my singing, I do every now and then just burst into song. But if you want to come out and actually see me sing, I'm in a, a duo with Andy, who's Laura's um, boyfriend actually, there he is. Um, and you can follow us on Instagram, it's two underscore tone underscore acoustic on Instagram or Facebook is where it lists all of the, the gigs that we're doing and how you can get in touch if you want us to play any event. Um, but yeah, I'd love to hear from you. You can, you can message me on there as well, I, I have got access to that on my phone. If you want to stay in contact with our lovely uh, director, Paul, I was going to say producer Paul, he's available for love. <laughs> Wedding plus ones, uh, dates, directors, he's fantastic. If you want to keep in touch with him, then it's at the underscore Duke 1111. You're quite, you're actually quite um, active on Instagram, aren't you? He likes Instagram. So if you do want to follow him, I try to do my best with my stories, but I'm, um, mm, I'm not very good. You're probably best on the Facebook, I'm better on the Facebook. Tom who is our lovely cameraman. He is obviously a fantastic photographer. Uh, this, is his, this is his website. If you want to stay in contact, if you ever need a photographer, of course, you can contact Tom. Um, who else? Hannah. Hannah, who's off to uh, Burma on Monday. You can follow her travels over the next month and her journey uh, through 2020. Keep in touch with her on Instagram. It's patterns and place. Search patterns on place on Instagram. I like the, photog the, the photography you're doing, it's lovely isn't it? That's her, that's a very posh Instagram, you can also find her actual Instagram on there. Her, if you click on more there'll be a link, link to her other Instagram on there as well but that's going to be the one with lovely pictures of our holidays. Um, okay, this last hour, are you ready? Keep your messages coming in because I've absolutely loved our interactivity today. It's such a lovely community and a family here. So I will be really, really sad to say goodbye, but I know that we'll all stay in touch. Let's start with uh, the other threads that we didn't get chance. Oh, didn't get a chance to do. Oh, okay. Laura's message saying, tell uh, Vix that Andrew's phone has gone crazy. This is Andrew, who I uh, am in my acoustic duo with. He is the, the more talented of the two. He's... I like to call him my human jukebox. I do this all the time and he hates it when I say, any requests? Does anyone want any songs? And they'll just shout at random songs and I'll look at Andy like, come on then, play it. And he's like, and he, do, and he goes, I don't really know. And then he'll stop playing it. He's the most incredible guitarist I've ever, ever met. He's amazing. So yes, I'm pleased that uh, lots of you are following us and I think his phone's going crazy. <laughs> right. Um, he, we're both on it. We're both on our, uh, we've both got it on our phone. He's very good at doing all of the, the uh, social media side of it. But I post as well. I do post as well. And if you message on there, then I'll get it. I will be able to respond to you. Um, okay, we're going to carry on with the Guterman threads. There were loads of you, loads and loads of you. 
that uh, missed out in the last hour. So we're going to carry on doing some more of the colours. 72p. It was £1.80. It's now 72. In fact, that's even lower, isn't it? Wasn't it 79 earlier? There you go. Got that one for 72p. The colour on that one is 227 if you want to buy any more of those. More of you have got it in your basket than we have availability. Um, I've got another orange one. This is like hot tomato, Hannah said. Not just any tomato, a hot tomato. Does it change colour as it's hot? Yes. We've decided. It is a lovely, lovely festival orange, isn't it? Oh, what was it? Um, I can't remember. Uh, Hannah's got a lovely cup of soup. Tomato and croutons. But she's eaten the croutons. Did you eat the croutons before the soup? Was... <laughs> okay. Your green, 154. 154. We've got a couple of green, green um, tones, actually. This is like celery green. Very descriptive. It's true. It is like the celery green. One by an 80 down to 72p. I love celery. I love celery. I think celery is one of those things that you either love or you don't like. But you're supposed to put it in all your soups, you know. Even if you don't like celery, put it in your soup. You won't taste it, but it's good for texture. And it's really good for you, isn't it? In fact, doesn't it burn calories if you eat it? No, it's not. It is a fact takes more calories to chew it than it does um paul's adamant that that's a fake fact i think that's a true fact let me know if you've heard that as well that's gone um i've got another shade of green another shade of green uh, that's 282 good shade of green isn't it 282 Okay, Hannah's calling this. Hannah's new job is going to be design, naming colours of Gutemann threads. This one's called Field from a Plane. When you're in a plane, looking down at a field, this is the colour. Right, anybody else, has, has anybody else got a, a, a more descriptive colour for this? Anybody else? Anyone? No? No. Paul has just said simple green. I'm going to say olive. I think that's olive. Like a few olives with your hummus. Hello, Lucy. Lucy in Dorset. Thank you so much for lots of giggles and great presenting, Vix. Always happy and good luck for 2020. You'll be missed. Love, Lucy. <coughs> Lucy, thank you so much for all of your messages over the last couple of years. It's been lovely to, to, um, to get to know everybody and to be in, in contact. It's such a lovely community. It really, really is. And, um, uh, even if I know Lucy as Lucy in Dorset, we all still have got to know each other. It's lovely. It will, I will genuinely sorely miss this place. It's the best place to, to, to work. I mean, I can't even believe that this is a job. It's my job. It's amazing. Very, very lucky to work with the team that I do. Um, 100. Right, before you start coming up with your crazy names, Hannah, I'm calling this Spearmint. This is like a lovely minty green. Go on then, Hannah. This is a fun game, isn't it? Eucalyptus is Paul's. And um, Hannah's calling this jungle girls in, a, in the distance. It isn't just a colour, it's always from a place. So in a plane or from afar. <laughs> if you're squinting. <laughs> jungle grass in the distance. Sil. <laughs> Sil, I think it was the last one that you're talking about. The one that we were talking about, celery. Uh, Sil is going to work in the department with you. She's going to call this one mush mushy peas. <laughs> they, they love that in the gallery. Paul's like, that's a good one. Jungle grass from a distance now sold out. <laughs> Please contact Guterman and ask for the official names. Jungle... Get Hannah a job and say, um, you know, jungle grass from a distance or... The, the fields from a plane. The technical words, obviously. Um, 286, this one. <laughs> What's up, Tom? Sorry, he's plugging something in. <laughs> he's all right. <laughs> I 
<laughs> well, can anyone guess what is Hannah's? Get Hannah's guesses in. I would say it is gold, isn't it? It's like a. It's it is quite a greeny gold though. What's that? What's that? Dusty golden what? Talisman. What's talisman? A lucky thing? Dusty golden talisman. Like an emblem. Is it something you wear like jewellery? Something that's lucky? From Indiana Jones. I'm with you. I'm with you. Okay, I'm going to stick with these sort of golden tones and go 300. Sand. I'm going to, oh, hay is a good one. Bale of hay. Bale of hay on the farm. <laughs> this one, the name by Hannah is Coral Reef through a scuba diving mask. I don't know whether they'll be able to fit that on the packaging. I always look at the colours of threads and, and also, you know, like the colours of lipsticks. They always have really cool names or nail varnishes. I like the names of those. Somebody must have that job, though, to name the names. Brilliant. Um, 179. These are really good sort of neutral colours, actually, aren't they? <laughs> 72p. Mini milk. <laughs> from where? Mini milk from an ice cream van. <laughs> Gosh, I don't... Does anybody still have an ice cream van that comes round? Obviously in the summer. Ice cream men don't come round the roads anymore like they used to. They, I, used to I genuinely used to have two ice cream men that used to come round our road. One at like half three once we'd finished school and then one about six o'clock. <laughs> We have ice cream shops, to be fair. Two pounds, uh, sorry, 249. It's not two pounds, it's just, well, it's less than 80 pence. A camel, I was thinking camel. I was saying camel hoof in, in the desert. Oh, can I just say something hilarious that, um, can I just say something hilarious? I can't promise it's hilarious. Um, although I did watch on Boxing Day, if you've ever watched John Scott on This Morning, having, because we were talking about John, I was talking about John, um, because I put the channel on to see what was on on Boxing Day and it was John's repeat show. So then we got talking about John and I said, you need to watch this video on YouTube of him having a regression where his brother had a camel. That's what it reminded me of and it's really funny. And John's just crying laughing it's really funny if you've not had have you not watched it before just type in john scott on youtube where you find it um 199 this one is it's 72 pence what we call in this one this is a difficult one to to name mud from a long walk on the moors slightly dried Slightly dried mud from a long walk on the moors. That's Hannah's name for this one. I think she's got a, you know, a, a, a real shot, a real future ahead in naming Gutemann coloured threads. It's great. 72 pence. Uh, let's go with the dark grey. I'm going to call this uh, gunmetal grey. This one's number 141. It looks darker on my screen than it is. Than it is. It's a real lovely silvery grey. No, it's not Guinness. Not Guinness. Can you see? Look, it's got a bit of a sheen to it. It's got like a grey sort of sheen. It's like platinum deep. It reminds Hannah of the, um, the hair dyeing adverts for men. You know, like the shawl for men. 
that are like a real, they're like a dart but with a sheen of silver. <laughs> You know, that real natural dark black with a, with a, a hint of sheen. Okay, number 18, the last Gutenberg thread. 18 is like a real deep bottle green. The lining of a pirate's jacket. Or a magician's jacket, okay. Did you see the magician at my wedding? <laughs> 72 beds. So you didn't see the magician there? <laughs> That's one pound 80, it's now just 72 pence. That lovely deep green. I wish I could be a magician. Oh, speaking of magicians, um, Dancing on Ice starts in the new year, doesn't it? Um, there's a magician on it. There's a magician on it called, I think his name's Ben Hamlin. Don't quote me on that, but he's a magician. And um, he's Kieran, my Kieran's new best friend. New best friend. They went out in Warwick together and now the rest is history. They're best friends. So I'm very excited to be um, there as his friends and family at the front row of Dancing on Ice. <laughs> I really hope I am gonna make it there. I am gonna make it there. They made a real good connection on um, Christmas Eve, <laughs> that one night. <laughs> okay, can we do these little hobby gifts? Because these are lovely. Look, they've got pink cushions filled with buttons. Once, it's, once you've used all your assorted buttons, you could then fill it with all sorts. You could fill it with um, sweets, pins, extra buttons, more buttons that you collect. Leftover hexes. Uh, remember, it's an assortment of buttons, so there's loads of different colours and shapes in there. It's two pounds. And that's such a lovely gift for somebody. I've stocked up on a few of these for, um, from the clearance. We've all been raiding the stock with these bargains. And it's not in glass, so you don't need to worry about the postage. It's breaking in the post. But it's great that it's got that really nice little pin cushion as well, isn't it? Really handy. Look at that big button. You might not get that one. It's an assorted button. I love it. Oh, I love... I mean, you've got loads of buttons in here, haven't you? That's going to keep you topped up. And the thing is, if you start, um, if you start collecting buttons off clothes... They might be like little black buttons or beige buttons or brown buttons. Boring buttons, basically. Some of these are really, really exciting buttons. As far as buttons go, eh? They're exciting buttons. Okay. No. Don't count me down. Paul's saying, that's my job. You've got 40 minutes left, Vix. Oh, it's sad, isn't it? Really sad times. Make sure you tune in the next few days. Remember, John's going to be with you. Um, and of course, Tash will be here on the 30th as well on Monday. 6.99. Down to £1.99. Thank you for following me on Instagram and Facebook. If you join us on Facebook, Two Tone Official, find us on Facebook, then you'll see where I am. I always try and do, um, well, I always try and update where I am, where I'm singing each week. Uh, so if I come to near you, come and see me. There are lots of open gigs or, of course, you can, um, you can book us. No problem. <laughs> also, quite often, Paul is there. I'm sorry about that, but Paul is there quite often. So you might even get a, um, a, a little look in, a, a smooch with Paul, a smacker with Paul. <laughs> Can't promise, but it's likely. It is likely. OK. What's this? Let's do the notions tape first. Um, I've not seen this textile colour. Textile colour. Okay, this is Christmas themed, but do you know what? At £2.40, you can't miss it. Save it for next year. And it's a nice little bit of memorabilia as well, isn't it? Sewing quarter. It is our very own notions range. Claire, who fell in love with the airport? She's messaged in on my iPad. Um, Claire, Claire makes things on Instagram, doesn't she? It hasn't come through to my iPad, it might just take a second. She says, I'm a, fi I'm a figure skater. You see Ben Hamlin practicing while you're skating, okay. You might even see me on the background. 
Claire? Right, Claire, what's Claire's Instagram? Because I need to follow her. You have the best story. Is that the, her name? Claire who makes things with some underscores. I'll find you. I will find you on Instagram. Um, that's amazing. So, because you live in Solihull, don't you? So I know that he's from Warwick, which is where I live. All his family lives there because he was obviously home for Christmas. But no, I'd never heard of him before. But apparently he's an amazing music, uh, musician, magician. But Kieran did, I did say to him, Kieran, I hope you didn't ask him to do any magic tricks because then he won't be your friend. So, yeah, he didn't. This, I've never seen this before. Come on then, Hannah's the textiles um, queen here. This is your gold pearl paint. Oh, look at that. Gold paint, amazing. Let me read the packet. So it's, it's um, opaque, universal and fabric paint. When using on fabric, let the item dry after application. Set the iron to a temperature suitable for cotton and fix in five minutes. Place a piece of baking powder between the painted fabric and the iron. Baking paper. What did I say? Baking powder. <laughs> Pull your baking powder on. We're not making a cake here. Uh, two pounds. It's lovely though, isn't it? Four pound ninety-nine down to just two pounds. I've never seen that before. It's about to sell out. I've got some more ribbon. Some more ribbon for you. Um, the lovely gingham. I think you should try and dress nice at the airport if you want your upgrade. Hannah's still trying to figure out how she's going to get her upgraded flight. Just tell them you're travelling alone. Tell them you're travelling alone and ask if there's any room to upgrade. Have you checked out if there is upgrades available on that? Um, when I say upgrades available, I mean, is there a, another class of seats on that airline? Because there might not be. Sometimes they don't have them, do they? You might just have economy, just so everybody's all together. What, um, what flight is it? Air Turkey. £3.49 down to just £1.40. You lovely gingham. About to sell out. Carry on going through. Um, I've got the cotton tape. Your Millwood cotton tape. Once everybody's checked out, that is about to go. Apparently, they're quite fancy, Hannah's saying. The lounges, fancier than you just going to the airport. Oh. Eighty pence. 80 pence for your cotton tape. Five metres on there, 13 millimetre wide, 480p. Hannah, you should have so many air miles. Hannah's like travels everywhere. She's going to be fantastic on her Instagram. One pound ninety nine, just a sixty. No, but what's what's the worst they're going to say? No, sorry, madam, we haven't got any spaces to upgrade. And then you just go, okay. You don't need to make eye contact with them. Just go, okay. <laughs> look down. She says, "There's that awkward eye contact thing." You don't. You just look away like this. Say okay, and then carry on. Okay, let's do the paint. Well, I say paintbrushes. They're marking pencils. Oh, we actually have paintbrushes. Oh, amazing. If you manage to get the, uh, the gold paint, then obviously what do we need? Paintbrushes. These are lovely. Um, I'd really like the, the end of these as well. I always am short of these style paintbrushes, actually. £2.80. £2.80. It was £6.99, now £2.80 for all 12 of your natural line brushes. Are you going to do some artwork while you're out there? Are you going to do some sketching or painting? Take a sketchbook. These are lovely, um, fine paintbrushes. What sort of painting do you use this for? These, these paint. These are size um, 8.
You can never have enough though, can you? Uh, the marking pencils that I was looking at earlier, these are perfect on white fabric in particular because you've got the different colours, the blue and the, the pink will be great for, for lighter coloured fabric. You've got the brush cap included. You also make marking pencils. Remember, um, we all have different personal preferences, don't we, for, for marking tools. These are just one pound, 12 pence. Thank you so much for all of your lovely messages and I really, really hope everybody has a lovely, um, lovely new year. We will all thoroughly, thoroughly miss your company every day. It's been um, amazing over the last few years, the last two years. I can't believe it, it's two years ago that I started here now. It's been ages. You've helped me with so much. Honestly, I've learned so many new skills. Should we do the um, pack of three coggin threads? All of our, um, our stranded cotton has been very, very popular today. This is your coggin thread from Susan Briscoe. Susan Briscoe actually got this in for us. £3.20, it was £7.99, now just £3.20. 100% cotton, three skeins, 18 metres each. In yellow. I have got one of these on their own, but you may as well make the most of um, the multi-pack. We've got loads to do, Han. I've just looked at all these patterns as well. It's fine, it's fine. We can fit it all in. I've got the Coggin Singular in yellow. <laughs> just on its own. Two pounds, 67, down to one pound and seven pence. So are you guys not here on the 30th? Is it, put, is it you're on the aeroplane? Is it um, Jesse and Chris then? It'll be Jesse and Chris with you on Monday. Han, do we know what um, it says at the top of the packet here? Your finest cogging thread is Hannah's guess. Two pounds sixty-seven down to just one pound seven pence. That's a lovely colour, isn't it? Deep royal blue. That's a really nice colour. I like that. Just one pound and seven pence. There's lots of people multi buying and taking advantage of the free PMP. If you open your order earlier on, lots of people still getting involved. I've got your bias maker. Oh, these are so handy. Have a look on YouTube and see a demonstration on this. I haven't got time to do it, but it's so simple to use. You feed your fabric through, it pulls through. Can you see this little lever? So you pull that out and you can even pin that to your ironing mat and um, just pull your iron along and you can make your own bias binding with whatever fabric you want. This is our very own one as well. It's from Sewing Quarter. For just £3.60. Thank you for all of your interactivity today. It's been lovely, really lovely to have your company. You've made the last hour um, really, really special. Hello, Joyce. Joyce has said good luck to all the team in their future ventures and travels. Oh, thank you very much, Joyce. Hans going off on her travels on the 30th on Monday for a month. She's off to Burma. Which is exciting. Elaine in Lincolnshire will miss sewing quarter too. Hope 2020 is a good year for all at sewing quarter. Good luck in the future endeavours and a happy new year. Happy new year to you too, Elaine. Thank you for taking the time to message us. We're all ever so sad. We really, really are. Um, it's been our family and our home for the last three years. A lot of people here have been here from day dot. So it'll be a really sad day on Monday, but um, we'll all keep in touch. We will all keep in touch. Shall we do some... Have I got these, have we got any of these pattern, the templates? No templates, okay, I can move them to the side. Have we got patterns? I've got a really cute little baby one, simplicity. Baby accessories pattern. Oh, amazing. Do you know what, all of my friends, so many people around me having babies at the minute. <laughs> I've got to get stocking up on um, things like this. 
Little baby shoes, how cute are they? When's your friend Liberty's wedding, Hannah? Miami, sorry. Miami's getting married. At Easter. Hans bridesmaid. Up in Scotland, up in Scotland. £7.49, down to just £2. You've got the little toy, you've got the bib, the little blanket, little shoes, how cute are they? That's really good, you've got a lot for your money there at £2, haven't you? Lots of different um, patterns. I'm going to move on to some cool dressmaking patterns. We've got a skirt here. This one is size... 14 to 22. We've only got it in size 14 to 22. This is a really nice skirt. Oh, is this the one that Helen Rhiannon made for Laura? I think this is the one that Helen Rhiannon made for Laura. Looked lovely. She wore it um, to one of our gigs the other night. It was really, really nice. And I did spot it and I said, oh, Have you got a new skirt? And she said, This is the one Helen Rhiannon made for me. And then I said, Oh, Laura, it's really nice. And then she said, um, thank you, I, I really like it, it's the first time I've actually worn it, but it looks nice, doesn't it? It works really well. And then I said, you know, that's like the whole um, Governor and Stacey at the um, services, wasn't it? Oh, you need to watch it, Paul, you would love it. Paul's never watched it. <laughs> Did anyone else get a tap for Christmas? Hot or cold? What size was it? Oh, I've got, um, <laughs> I've got O1. Oh. Right, so, this was again from my, um, my bridal show. This was from my bridal show earlier on in the year. Helen Rhiannon made, I'm not sure which one it was. I don't know if it was this one or it might have been this one in the beautiful pink satin. It is lovely. Do you remember? All prom style dresses. These are great, aren't they? Sizes 6 to 14. Lots of great techniques to learn in there as well. This lovely sort of fish tail style dress. Whether you do bridal or whether you do prom dresses, whether you're making prom dresses for somebody. For just two pounds. Who's this, Sarah? Sarah in Dorset. We will be fine. Don't worry about us, but thank you for your... Um, Thank you for your lovely message. Come see me singing. Come see me singing. And, um, and I'll invite everybody along. If you let me know on my, uh, on my Facebook that you're coming, then I'll invite all of the sewing quarter gang. Uh, Facebook is at Two Tone Official, Two Tone Official, or Instagram, two underscone, underscone. <laughs> I've said it every, every time I've said underscone, underscore. It's that little dash at the bottom. It's an underscone. Um, under the scone, you see. <laughs> it's like a plate. Like a plate for under your scone. Two underscore tone underscore. <laughs> Acoustic. The control button had us now. Oh, you're on about the mouse. The mouse. There's a button that's called control on the keyboard. Hannah calls it curl. Because it says, it's, where's your T? C T R L, but it looks like curl. Doesn't. Hannah's brain, my word. What's that? This one's 14 to 22. We've got the other size. This is 14 to 22. Sorry, we did the 6 to, six to 14 before. This is 14 to 22. Two pounds for all of these different style dresses as well. The McCall's patterns are classic, aren't they? Absolutely classic. As I say, we uh, did demonstrate this. It's beautiful, isn't it? Lovely for a prom dress. Special occasion. Have you got any balls to go to? Any cocktail parties? Oh, I've never seen McCall's toy pans. Have you? These are great if you've got the little felt. Um, the felt pieces that we had earlier on. I've never seen this before. Look at this, I've never seen this before. Look at the bunny, the bear with his waistcoat, the little dog with his tutu, and your cat. 
Oh, these are lovely, aren't they? Just two pounds. Oh, we love that. That's really good fun, isn't it? And I love it. I think this would be great in um, felt as well. Hello, Diane. Lots of people in Devon today. New year, new start. And do you know what? You're absolutely right, Diane. It's exciting and we have to see it as that. I know we're all saying we don't want a new start. We like it where we are. Um, she says, and I feel like a stalker. Haha, <laughs> best wishes to you all. Follow us, follow us all, follow us all. Don't forget, John's got Sewing World. If you haven't already subscribed, absolutely subscribe because there's really exciting things going to be happening there in 2020 um, and follow us all on on facebook and and social media we love 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 you, for you to keep in contact diane absolutely um i've got the home furnishings from mccall's now this has got cafe curtains i love a good cafe curtain look like that cafe curtains you've also got your bulletin board a bulletin board so like your your notes to do to put on there you've got loads of things to do hands got a big to-do list haven't you um your chair cushions which is lovely chair cushions that have got the ties on you've also got a placemat in there you've got a napkin in here you've got a coffee maker cover i was just looking at the shape of that coffee maker cover, that's like a toaster Anyway, um, yeah, I've got a toaster cover. You've got a can opener cover. Oh, my word. Right. I really want to make a can opener cover. A toaster oven cover. What's the difference between a toaster cover and a toaster oven co cover? You've got a tea cozy. A tea cozy. <laughs> You've got a bag holder, a pot holder and a casserole cover. This is the best pattern ever. Look at this to cover your casserole. It's like a bag. That's good, you know, if you're taking a casserole around to a friend's, isn't it? But look, this is your toaster holder and this is your toaster oven. So I'm guessing this is for your actual toaster and this is for like a toast rack. My gran used to always do this. When I used to go and stay at my grandma's, she used to make me, you know, I'd have my cereal and she'd always make the toast and put it in a toast rack. You have to put your toast rack, don't you, in the middle so it gets cold. So maybe you put a toaster cover over you tote like a teapot cozy very good idea two pounds for loads loads and loads and loads of patterns in there gonna sell out anything you want we got it in the words of roy orbison i'm so pleased that you love roy orbison as much as i do paul we tend to have we tend to have the same trends in music don't we we seem to like the same people at the same time your McCall's pattern again, this is size um, 16 to 26. A nice sort of wardrobe builder, isn't it? Lots of different sleeve options. You right there, Hannah? Just two pounds. Oh my word, I feel sorry for the people that are sitting next to you on the plane. Hannah all day has been moaning about the different sorts of people that she's sat next to on the plane. I think everybody needs to be clear of Hannah on the plane. Can we show a picture of her just in case you're flying with Turkish Airways on Monday? Just avoid at all costs sitting next to Hannah. When you try and get an upgrade, when you get a, an upgrade, when you try and get an upgrade, just make sure you've blown your nose beforehand, Hannah. Don't be doing that whilst you're in the queue. No, they won't like that. Oh, she gets allergic to the plane aircon. So, what's your excuse here, Hannah? We're not on the plane. Oh, I love this style dress. This reminds me, my friend um, at my wedding, she had a lovely lilac dress like this. It's beautiful. Oh, look at the different designs. I like this as well. That's more, I like the, um, the little sleeves. Wrap style dresses are so on trend and they're really flattering. I think they suit everybody. I love the bottom of this. This is my, um, my pick of the show. V-neck, beautiful dress pattern for just two pounds. Just two pounds. What's wrong, Paul? 
Hannah says she's not sure about this whole cold shoulder situation. I personally wear this quite a lot. These, I love this. My auntie was saying the same thing actually, or she wasn't sure about that. But I really like it. I think it's very on trend. Paul then says he, he doesn't like the cold shoulder situation either. Come on, you can still message, you can still get a, a date with Paul. Come on, help him out. Today and tomorrow, we've got one more day to help him find a date. It can still happen. He's been here since day dot. We've been trying to force him on someone since day dot. <laughs> I'm only joking. I missed all the pictures of um, Sean's son, Jack. Apparently they were topless. Eight to 16. Was 9.99, now just two pounds. Way more than 60% off. He's a very attractive boy, apparently. Is this trying to set you up, Anna? This is Hannah's future husband. She says, I'll find him. <laughs> 16, 8 to 16. They're lovely dresses, aren't they? I like this one as well with the nice big long sleeves. Nice floaty sleeves. Oh, is this the one that we did with Victoria Peach? Remember I wore it on air? It's got, um, we had it in a big uh, sort of bright, I want to say red and black print, didn't we? It was during the Great British Sewing Week. During the Great British Sewing Week, if I, um, if I remember. Oh my word, Hannah! Hannah! Ha who's, who sons this? Oh, Hannah, he's really lovely. I can't show you pictures on la a live air right now because we haven't had permission. Um, so is this your future husband? Is this who set you up? He doesn't know yet. He's lovely, Hannah. I think you've done very well there. He doesn't know that he's marrying you yet. Who's setting you up, though? Mainly John. Maybe he can wear this to the wedding. Maybe you can wear this to the wedding. Size XL, XXL, XXXL. It was how much? It's bigger than 60% off, in fact, actually, on this one. It was 9 99 It's now just two pounds. We've got 15 minutes left of today's show. Don't make me cry, Paul. Goodbye, my lover. Unfortunately, I, um, I will see you again, Paul. Um, maybe not this year, maybe into the new year. What are you up? Your, I will see Hannah as well. We'll all keep in contact. Christine in Durham. Oh, don't. I don't like reading emails like this. I can't believe how much you've grown over the years. I know it's all the mince pies. It's all the mince pies, Christine. Um, I feel honoured to have shared so much. Uh, you've, you've shared so much with us over these, uh, the first days, trying to get noticed. Me singing. Learning so much from John, absolutely. Doing my quilting classes, doing my classes to gain more experience. Run up to the wedding and becoming a bright star on your own. It's been a pleasure to watch you. Wishing you all the best for the future in whatever you do. God bless you. Lots of love from Christina Durham. Christine, honestly, that is so lovely. It means so much to me from coming from a, you know, a, uh, coming into a world where everybody is, you know, you feel that everybody's a really experienced sewer. It's quite daunting to start a new language. I, I felt like when I first started here, I did not understand. It was just this jargon that everyone, we all just say now and don't even realise. Paul still don't understand any of it. He still thinks we are talking in a different language. Um, but no, it's everybody's been so welcoming. I think this is what's so beautiful about the community Sewing Court has created is it isn't just encouraging, you know, the expert sewists and we've seen some amazing, amazing projects from people who've been sewing for years and years and years and we've learnt lots of tips from them. But also, it's encouraged everybody to start a new skill or start a new hobby uh, and a very useful one at that. Very useful indeed. Or dust off your sewing machine and get it back out and have another go. I, I know so many people who have got back into sewing because of Sewing Quarter. So thank you very, very much, because I've learned a lifelong skill, which, um, yeah, I will always, always have. It's amazing, isn't it? But it's only thanks to you guys for encouraging me. If, if anybody would have said, oh, no, she don't know about sewing, get her off, get her off. 
then I would have been intimidated, but no, everyone was so welcoming. Lo loads. £8.49 down to just £2 for your lovely pattern with, again, so many different projects in there. My apron. Uh, you've got an ironing board cover. You've got an organiser. This is great. You've got a peg bag on there by the looks of things. You've got coat hanger covers. You've got storage boxes. Look at this little mini washing line. <laughs> That's Paul's washing line. <laughs> Oh, we're going to miss jokes like this, aren't we? We're going to miss all these jokes. Paul's not going to miss it. <laughs> oh, he's laughing, he's laughing. 8.49 to just two pounds. He can't stop laughing. <laughs> Jan's let us know. Well, a toaster oven is, uh, Jan, thank you, in Lancashire. She says, toaster oven is a mini oven with elements top and bottom to toast both sides. <laughs> Grill using top element or bake. Oh. It's like a little oven that you put on the side. Oh, I feel like I've seen them before in like cafes. Do they do them? It's like a little grill, is it? I don't know. Thank you though, Jan, for explaining that. Um, right, should we do some books? <laughs> Uh, we've got some patterns. Start with a square. Oh, this is on YouTube, actually. If you want to watch this back, this was a really good show with Karen, wasn't it? Uh, if you just type in Karen Hellaby, you could probably find it. It's really clever. No fabric wastage, no matching points, no strange angles. Just cut, um, just cut. it's fun to sew. We sold 500 of these in two minutes. It was one of the busiest shows that we've ever done. It was a really, really clever technique. No rulers. Um, it was on the 2nd of the 8th, if you want to watch it back over the next few days, absolutely make the most of it. So peel away the covers and reveal a feast of pineapple chunks and expo exploding pineapples, not to mention an inspirational gallery of brand new quilts created with the latest fabrics. It's sold out in minutes at 8 99 You've now got it at just £3.60. Great, isn't it? Look at all of these. You can do the pineapple quilt without a ruler. So simple pineapple. I love that. Just £3.60 and all very, very clear instructions from Karen. £3.60. Make the most of it because that will go any second. We've got 10 minutes left. Um, Stitch textiles. Oh, this looks lovely. Alice, uh, Amanda Hislop, this is like, my, my mum's middle name's Hislop. I've never heard anybody else that have got Hislop in their name. Have you? Do you know anybody with a, a name called Hislop? It's my mum's middle name. A middle name, yeah. <laughs> I swear, I promise it is. They're like, no, that's not her name. No, it's her name. That's my mum's name. Look at all of this. This is very arty, isn't it? It's a beautiful book. Very textual. The rule of thirds. Looking for detail. Light and colour. There's only six of these left. This is beautiful. This is a lovely coffee table book, isn't it? Mixing art with your textiles. Did you study textiles at school, Hannah? It's beautiful, isn't it? I love this. Two left. Stormy sea and waves. Things left behind, you incorporating things that you found on a walk, twigs and shells and fossils, they're lovely. Um, it's about to sell out, about to sell out. I've got Stitch and Fix, these are all new books to me. Essential Mending, um, Know How for Bachelors and Babes. Paul, Joan Gordon. Hey, hello Joan. Love this, I've never even seen this before for Bachelors and Babes. A great mending techniques. 
See, this is the thing, isn't it? Whenever, uh, button up, baby. Burden up. Sewing on hooks and eyes, sewing on snap fasteners, Velcro closures, ironing on Velcro closures, metal snaps. Quick as a flash. Zip it, a section on zips, replacing zips. Do you know, there was a really lovely expensive shop, I must say, that did all massive reductions on things that have got faulty zips. So if you've got this and you just know how to just replace a zip, you don't need to be a dressmaker to, to get a really lovely dress. Very, yeah, there's a, there's a shop that's doing all of these. I oh, know, I was gonna buy them all and just change the zips. Look, there's Paul. Men in with back, uh, back stitch, taking in a seam, letting out a seam, repairing a split seam. Stretch fabric, hemmed in. This is a great book, isn't it? Because that's the one thing you always get asked as soon as you start sewing is, can you turn this up? Can you alter this? Can you mend this? Isn't it? Preventing bra straps from slipping off shoulders. Repairing an underwire bra, amazing. These are all things I've never actually seen in a, in a, in a book, actually. Repairing an underwire bra, that's useful, isn't it? Because when it comes out, it, yeah. Yeah, you hear us, sisters, don't you, black bachelors out there? Replacing a drawstring. Fixing a, fixing a zip. So you could be the one fixing the zip. Turning a pleat into a dart, that's really good, 4 99 love that. Okay, um, I've got the hoop. See, these are great, not only just to have whilst you're doing your embroidery, but also for displaying. Really nice, I've, there was a, a really fancy bar in Nottingham that I was singing at, and they had their whole wall full of fancy bar in Nottingham. You wouldn't believe it, Tom, but there is. He's from Nottingham. I can't think what it was called, but they had a whole wall of, um, of embroidery hoops. It was called Fancy Bar. We've got five minutes. I don't, I start getting all, um, oh, don't like it, I don't like it. But anyway, it's been amazing. It really, really has. Thank you everybody who's um, tuned in to see my last show and say goodbye to me. Loads of messages have come in. Thank you very, very much. £3.49 for what? £1.40 now. I'd be multi-buying on this. One pound forty, amazing. Um, Hannah and, and Paul said thank you for their followers as well. They've got loads more followers again today. There's Paul's follow it. How to fall, uh, follow Paul on Instagram. If you want to keep up to date, if you want to still try and find him love. Um, Hannah is going to be traveling the world in 2020. You can follow her on Instagram patterns and place search her on instagram and you can see all of her travel photography and we might even appear on there there i am if you want to follow me on facebook it's at two-tone official that's the um the, the duo the acoustic duo i'm in with andy laura's boyfriend so you'll often see lots of the sewing quarter gang um coming to all my shows and two underscore tone underscore acoustic for instagram and then tom if you want to follow his uh, his photography website page Instagram links on there, Facebook links on there, but you can um, find Tom on there. Most importantly, there's Paul. Okay, you are. Let's do the chalk wheel. The chalk wheel. Two pounds 20. They were 5.49 down to just two pounds 20. What great, great reductions on everything today. I've still got another couple of things that I do want to squeeze in. We've got three minutes to do it. Oh, can we do the little handmade thing? This little handmade charm. I'd like even this in a bracelet, or you could have it as, um, you could stitch it onto a special quilt or a bag, or this is lovely. I've got handmade and silver. Three ninety nine down to one pound sixty for your little handmade, and it's got the little connectors either side, so you can just stitch that onto one of your projects. That would be nice for a gift for somebody, wouldn't it? One pound sixty. I've also got it in a 
um, an antique bronze. One pound sixty. Three pounds ninety-nine. I will be bringing in the um, Hannah's going to bring in the graphics for the antique bronze colour. That one again can just be attached to any of your makes. Nice if you're gifting something to have that little bit of embellishment. How do we follow Lucy? Just one pound sixty. Oh yeah, you could make even like a necklace. Yeah, good idea. One pound sixty. Had a lovely email come in. Uh, Hannah's just putting it onto a, a, a slide for it. Hello, everyone. Oh, don't say that for the last time. <clears throat> I would almost be worth getting married. Uh, it would almost be worth getting married if just John Scott would come to the wedding. Oh, absolutely. It, it, I think um, he was talking about me and Tom putting together a wedding package. We said that we're going to have John as well as a, a, a master of ceremonies. We're going to do it. Hannah, could I organise the honeymoon travel arrangements? And Vicky, who would, wouldn't want you to have you there singing? Thank you very much. Absolutely. Book me for your weddings. Um, <laughs> so glad you've come back for the final show, Vicky. You've been such a delightful presenter and it's been lovely to watch you grow in that role. Uh, with the very best wishes to you and all at Sewing Quarter. That's from Mac. Come to the Highlands in the summer uh, where it stays light all through the night. It's beautiful here. We're already planning a trip to the Highlands. We're already trying um, to make sure we come up and visit the Highlands. I can do a few singing gigs and Tom can come up and do some beautiful photography and we can come do a Sewing Quarter tour. <gasps> okay, the, wet and the menu might surprise you. You ready? <laughs> You've got John Scott coming up with you tomorrow. The penultimate day of sewing quarter with warehouse clearance all day. It's been an absolute pleasure to have your company over the last two years that I've been here. I've thoroughly, thoroughly loved working with every single person behind the scenes, the guest designers, and of course, thank you so much for all of your support and encouragement from our, um, from our community and our Sewing Quarter family. It's been overwhelmingly amazing. Thank you for all of the, the, the followers as well today. I'll, I'll be sure to keep you up to date with what I'm doing. John, um, of course, is going to be with you bright and early tomorrow morning at eight o'clock. And of course, Tash and John will be there with you on the 30th. So we'll all be watching, won't we? <gasps> with tears in our eyes. Lots of love. Take care, everybody. Thank you for your company. We'll see you tomorrow. How do you fancy a massive 60% off your sewing supplies? Sewing Quarter are offering 60% off everything. Head to www.sewingquarter.com to check out the offers and to shop. You can also shop via our UK call centre on 0800 112 4433. Follow us on Instagram. Search for our Sewing Quarter page and follow us to get our latest posts. From gorgeous florals to nursery rhyme themed prints and paisley, our Lessienne fabrics are great for all your vintage style makes. And what's more, they're at a discounted price. Visit our website at www.sewingquarter.com to view the full range and discounts.